<clears throat> Hello. I know life. I see you're trying to be a sassy little child. <laughs> How's everyone doing today on this fine afternoon? Oh wait, my birthday is actually... <laughs> my birthday is right on the doorstep. Mm. Yeah, I have no plans. <laughs> I think that much should be obvious. Hey, hey, hey. My my life has been like an absolute like dumpster fire for the like the past couple months, but uh, I, I'm getting some good days here and there at least. Today's a good one. I got some good sleep and I actually feel sort of good. <laughs> I wonder what I should have for lunch though. Nothing too crazy, just something that's like filling, I guess. I realized I haven't really... You're gonna try finally setting up OBS later? Alright. Neat. Yeah, if you need help, just let me know. I'll, I'll try to help the best I can. Just, uh... For warning, I don't teach people often. <laughs> But you're welcome to chill here for as much as you want. You have a friend that's gonna help? That's good. MK? <laughs> that's probably not. But you didn't answer. What? A answer what? When is be- Oh. Oh, I didn't see the question. Sorry. When is B-Day? My VTuber birthday that I set is February 9th. But my actual birthday is a couple of days away from that. <laughs> Actually, I already, I already said what my actual birthday is in the past, so... Not really much point in hiding it, is there? It's the 11th. <laughs> I just won't tell you how old I am. Thank you, JMD! Hey, it's good to see you! How, how are you? I, I know it's been a hot minute. I, I mean, I've been going through it with life, so I, I just stream when I do feel like it. <laughs> it's a little impromptu. When did I get a new jacket? Um, Some odd weeks ago, I decided to, uh, you know, revamp my model just a little bit. This, this is just like one of the jackets that you can put on your model and... Um... Was it Droid or was it V2 Studio? It, one of those programs can allow you to make your own 3D model. And that's that's how I'm here. <laughs> I, I I did this myself. Oh, I gotta get up and get Snacko. Well <sighs> Be right back, guys! Actually, I might as well just grab myself a lunch. So I'll take a little extra longer. <laughs> Is there a way I can get this? Oh, wall. Maybe I can- maybe I can give you, like, some weird funny picture. Image. What have I got?
Uh, sure, let's go with this one. <laughs> Enjoy.
Okay, guys, I'm back. Oh, yeah, I just remembered something. Uh, oops, accidentally pulled out my, uh, uh audio cord. Uh, oh, well. I will have to let my pat pop in around, like, three-ish. So, in about, like, two hours. Because, uh... I never really told anybody, but... Uh, I guess which scenes. One of my window blinds... has finally broke. After... decades of being used. <laughs> and, and so I, I have to... I have to get help uh, replacing that. I... The... The... Th I do have the new window blinds. So, I just need help with that. Also, somebody broke my uh, window. Just like the outside layer, thankfully, so I don't have like a full on hole. But uh, my pap app's gonna have to help me get it to the. Uh, to the glass place so I can get like measurements and get a replacement for the window. So that's fun. <laughs> that that's some of the issues that cropped up over like the past few weeks aside from like family stuff. So uh we'll just chill for however long I possibly can. Also, I really like this is unrelated to like everything else I've been saying, but I, I sincerely need to add a button on my stream deck that allows me to get into my new scene, which is the Switch games. Which allows me to, you know, just seamlessly transition to the scene where you guys can see Switch games. Because the other scene I have, which is my in-game, is for more so for PC games. A little funny short story, uh, Nano was helping me out with getting it to where I don't have to stream this through the Elgato, like, uh, HD, like, the 4K thing, the program. So I could just, like, send this, I, I could just send the stuff directly to OBS instead of having to do it through that program and get uh, a, a, few, a few seconds delay. And I tell you what, this is so much better. <laughs> and ever since we made this scene, Nano, I remember the second that we managed to get it successfully done. And I was like, don't you dare touch it. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. <laughs> I'm like, okay. But at the, this is my room for now. I just actually recently got a new room. This is the new one. There's not much in it because obviously I, I gotta put stuff in there and get stuff. But for now it's a bathroom. <laughs> because because uh, two random people have been because uh, 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 like, one of the residents gave me one of these items and the other one's like congratulations again the new room. I think that came with, uh, with the Happy Homes thing. Yeah, it's been a hot minute, Cyan. How are you doing? I'm streaming a little bit today because I feel good. <laughs> we're, we're just chilling in with some coziness today. So, most of it's like me talking. <laughs> and, and me playing a bit of Animal Crossing. I love how you had to specify Coke the drink. <laughs> Do you hear that guy's sayings on crack? <laughs> but no, I know what you mean. 
What, did I rat you out? Oops. <laughs> Yeah, don't do crack, kids. Don't do any drugs, period. It's not worth it. I wonder what I should do today on Animal Crossing. I'm probably just gonna, like, try catching a whole bunch of things. Oh, that's a bit loud. Oh. <laughs> I'm gonna turn down my headset a little bit. I guess sell all this stuff. I don't know what I'm gonna do with this telescope. I wanna put it around somewhere. Maybe I could put it around one of my uh residents my villages villagers places. Oh also if you're playing like Animal Crossing New Horizons, I recommend you try to catch these snowflakes as much as you can and get in the recipes. Uh, the seasonal recipes. Which you can get from popping balloons and just finding stuff on the shore. Because it, it will be a nice uh, seasonal way to generate income with by selling those things. You just usually sell the s snowflakes? I actually did a little test. I clicked exclusively on like the stack of three snowflakes when in the selling option. And then th those two twin raccoons told me it was like very little compared to where a snowflake wreath is about like uh, 1600 bells. So, you're actually getting more if you craft, craft the items. <laughs> I know, it's wild, right? <laughs> but yeah, I just generally recommend crafting because I found that out. I don't know if it's with every item, but... I know you're definitely getting more of snowflake reefs than just like a couple snowflakes. Because compared to just selling like let's just say like four in four individual snowflakes all together, snowflake wreath will get you more. Misty tea. There's nothing like a refreshing bathroom where you can de-stress and refresh. <laughs> yes, thank you. Also, thank you, Plucky. For... Giving me something that actually goes with that room. Who has a jump scare? Eh. The mask looks okay. Honestly, I would like to... What's up, Cyan? <laughs> Are you not happy with the revelation, or...? I don't, I don't know what's going on. <laughs> hmm. You didn't know that that exists? What? The, the this item? It, it's um available until I think it's available until like either Valentine's Day or a couple days before. I see a snowflake in the background and it's <laughs> Hold on, I can the uh... I can sh I can show you. I mean, I gotta deposit some bells. Oh, there's a thing I gotta pop. Come here. Give me my free recipe. Ooh, I got some miles. You only played the game for two days and stop. <laughs> Why are you just starting out? 
or you have or have you been playing it but you just like recently did that two day stint You already built your kingdom in two days, my dude! What are you defining as your kingdom? <laughs> Payment. Fun fact, I did not take out this loan until I knew for a fact I could afford it. <laughs> Three days in a row, I got a hundred. Deposit full amount. And just like that, I can just <laughs> pay from savings. Oh, it's so nice to be able to do that. It is possible, you just have to sacrifice sleep? My dude. Same day I got the loan, the same day I paid it off in full. Let's go. Is there anything in here? Nope. Oh yeah, I gotta show you. The seasonal thing. Yeah, it's insomnia that week. Fair enough. Jeez, you should have seen how trash my sleep has been for like the past several weeks. Yep, yeah, it's right here. It's available until the 13th of this month. So get it while you can if you're interested. Also, there's Lunar New Year stuff. Ooh. I would like a lucky red envelope. I love how each day the color just changes. <laughs> then I still want it. When you have the chance? Sure. But yeah, fair warning. It's until the 13th. You got plenty of time until then, but. Figured I'd, rem I'd just restate until it's finally out. Chicken nuggies so good. I haven't had dinosaur shaped ones though. Not for a long time. This one kind of looked like white chocolate. Nuggies, yes. <laughs> Seems like they have a yellow versism today. Yesterday was pink for me, and the day before that was red. I'm not 100% sure, but I think yellow roses tend to have like a very sad meaning attached to them. Even though they're very beautiful. <laughs> hmm. I love the fact that they have this st stuff cataloged makes things so much easier bouquet changes colors it seems to be like each day because the venetian carnival mask for example it, it was silver yesterday and that's the one i showed you when i tried it on right outside my my home and while while you're in my home i don't know if you saw it or not but i had a I had a red heart shaped bouquet. I got that from two days ago by ordering through here. Today it's yellowish. <laughs> so I've noticed it, it changes colors per day up to up to when it finally 
is no longer in the seasonal. So, the bouquet itself, like the item itself, doesn't change, but like the option of it changes per day on, on the ordering system. Also, pro tip, if you're ever shaking trees as much as I do, always have a net out just in case. Because that will happen. <laughs> That's why! These jerks just show up and ruin your day. I can't believe that happened as I'm talking about it. You gotta be kidding me. Oh, okay, can I please get... Skill issue. <laughs> I can't believe that happened as I was talking about it. I didn't get my gut feeling told me. <laughs> you being an idiot and just running towards a nearby building? I mean, fair enough. If you don't have a net on you, that's like the best thing you can do. And let's pray that the door isn't locked. <laughs> Craftable. Eh. Oh yeah, if you have a tight on bells, you can always just like shake down a few trees. Oh, what's in here? Ski slope flooring. I'm learning all the seasonal recipes because of these ones. Honestly, I feel like the balloons, like the gifts you get from balloons in this game are far better than New Leaf because you, you can get crafting recipes and make all these things that you've always wanted to instead of having to wait for it in the shops and whatever. You wouldn't realize how many times I would get that stupid clown flooring. <laughs> Uh, balloon flooring, that is. I want to see the recipe. Ski slip flooring. I need eight for that? My dude. <laughs> Fine. I've been cr non-stop crafting these fro frozen fences because I just want to have the ability to use a whole bunch of them. This is my favorite thing, though. It's this one. It's... Falling snow wall. I, I just like how beautiful it is. All it takes is three snowflakes and a whole bunch of stone. <laughs> yeah, it moves! It's animated! That's a- that's- That's what I- what my favorite part about it is. The fact that it looks clean and beautiful. It moves! Oh, fun fact, this one's animated too. The ski slope wall, it's got animated snow. Yeah. You see? If you take a little closer look at it, it's got falling snow particles. Shame the people don't move. That'd make it, that'd make it wild. <laughs> you can improve your kingdom, yes. And there's also this snowflake wall. It's not animated, but just, I, the gradient does look nice on it. And, and you can also get a frozen chair recipe, but fair warning, to get a large snowflake, you have to deal with extremely picky snowmen. You know, I, I tried my best to make one of them even earlier, and they're like, oh, my head's just a little too big. Oh, shut up! <laughs> You are good enough. You're close to perfect. Deal with it. <laughs> and uh, you can also acquire the snowflake wreath recipe. <laughs> it only takes four snowflakes, which is pretty easy. This one takes five. It's customizable. <gasps> Wait, I can change the colors on it, dude. Most of your decor is made with with the uh, custom decal stuff. I that's actually not a bad idea. I'll get the snowflakes. 
I will get the mall. Free income, baby! All it takes is a net. <laughs> oh, and a couple tools to get across rivers if... You know. If you're dealing with that. No, I do not want the shovel. Yes, I want the net. Oh yeah, I actually uh, set this up about a day or two ago. <gasps> oh, it says Senpai, you came running when, <laughs> when you saw us playing this. <laughs> I'm happy that I made you happy. But yeah, I'm just chilling a little bit today on Animal Crossing. Because today is a good day. Fair warning though, I might have to leave at like 3 o'clock. Do I need anything? I mean, I'm not opposed to getting some more advanced recipes, if that's what you're asking. <laughs> Everyone's out here today. Also, I noticed that that you, you silly beans almost started a hype train while I was away. Hey, Eric. Wow, everyone's here. Why don't I just scream midday since everyone's just here? Oh no, my net. How dare you, Net? Uh, y y recipes that you can acquire. Like, that I might not have immediately. Like, how you can get some from the, the Nook shop. Ah, oh, why you tempt me like that? You know what? I'm making a flimsy net just to spite you, Snowflake. Ah, oh, there's two! How goes? Today's a good day. Oh, uh... Actually, can we even send, like, island recipes to stuff? Wait, we're, I think we're gonna have to, like, become friends or something. Or have you visit. You're also a millionaire! What?! I've got a sugar mom, guys. <laughs> I never thought I'd ever utter that sentence, but I legit do. <laughs> I've got a sugar mom. <laughs> okay, a flimsy net should suffice for now. Come here. Ha! Ah. You see that? That's why I keep 30 branches on me at all times. Is in, ca in case I got like emergency craft stuff. Now I can go indoors. <laughs> also, I am thinking of moving my home to a better spot. So I can... So I can do more decorations and stuff. Like, I like the location, overall location of my home because it's like right smack dab in the middle between the nook shop and the main building to access the ABD and stuff. But honestly, I like more room to where I can decorate around my house. Oh, thank you, Eric. I, hopefully, hopefully I'm not distracting you too much. Let, let's show it off. You see how gorgeous this thing looks? Yes. What does the Misty Tea look like again? I completely forget. I feel like I should have green shoes with this. Oh, okay, Eric. <laughs> okay. As long as you're not getting yourself in trouble. <laughs> Put in storage. Put in storage. You know, I'm, I'm gonna put it on the wall to see what it looks like. Me in trouble since when? I don't know. You're, you're always you're always suspicious. You're always very suspicious. 
Very suspicious beam. Hang on wall. Oh, it doesn't look too bad. Alright. I trust you. You're a you're responsible adult. <laughs> I, I only voice these concerns as a, you know, a little person. What, what about me? Am I suspicious? About as suspicious as a chaotic being could be. But I'm adorable, so I can get away with it however I which way I want. Mostly. <laughs> Became responsible. What? Oh. Oh yeah, that's right. I completely forgot about Puzzle Deck. Yeah, guys, we have a we have a puzzle bot that that takes up residence in the stream, which you guys can interact with, however often you like. It can do like a basic Wordle thing. It can also do a little bit of Hangman, <laughs> but it's down at the moment. But that still won't stop me from talking about it. <laughs> but yeah, it, it's some, it's a little something that you can, you guys can uh, interact with and have fun with, especially when I'm on be right back screen. Just gives you a little something to do. But unfortunately, like Eric said, it's down for whatever reason. He's still working on it. <laughs> and to be honest, I think we both forgot about it. <laughs> the switch is charging. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I feel like I should stick a, a, the mask on a wall. You didn't forget about it? Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm guessing you're just busy then. Let's have a mask just stare at you while you're t while you're peeing on the toilet. <laughs> I thought we were friends already on the switch. Not now you're gonna have to make me look, but I don't want to pull out my switch my switch thing on the stream. Hold on, I I think I, I could just turn off the viewing in the OBS. Uh, friends list online. Uh, what? No, we aren't. I'm friends with MK though. And no life. You just noticed my stream border is animated? Dude, it's been animated for who knows how long. <laughs> yeah, ever, ever since I uh, changed my overlay, it's been like this. You had some recent power outages lately. Oh no! I, I can give you my uh, switch code, senpai. And um... I think I uh, I think we have island codes for Animal Crossing too, right? I I can also give that to you. No issue. Of course I can. I don't mind taking a minute. <laughs> Science blind. Gotta get some glasses, buddy, or contacts. You silly bean. <laughs> If we become friends, you won't need the island code? Okay, fair enough. Why does one of my friends ha have a picture of their neck as their profile picture? <laughs> what? <laughs> uh. Hurry up, switch! Yes, I know, I know that feeling. Honestly, I think compared to like just putting it on like a cord, it ch it charges in the dock like kind of faster. Which friend code? S W and then a whole bunch of numbers. I'm not gonna tell any of y'all. <laughs> Not until I feel, you know, comfortable. I don't know, I, I just tend to share it amongst certain people. It should charge the same technically. Yeah, it should, but I know that, like, generic cords compared to... You know, the Nintendo-issued one actually charges differently for whatever reason. Okay.
Yeah, because one's more uh, like a generic chord's like for general purpose, right? But for a chord that's like built to charge a dock or yeah, it, it it is the same, whether you put it into the dock or like the Nintendo core specifically, like whether you put, plug it into your Switch directly or the dock, it's the same charge rate. But if you try like a generic core, it, yeah, it depends on the wattage of the supplier too. But I've noticed like a generic cord compared to the Nintendo cord coming from the same outlet, so to speak. It, at least for me, it's it's been different. Because one actually keeps up with keeping the percent charge up and the other one it just slowly goes down you just use your mac charger <laughs> I, I i usually use the nintendo charger because it, it's much faster also i want this to actually like directly stare at you while you're trying to pee on the toilet just so just so i can Just so I can uh, make any guest uncomfortable. <laughs> Why I'm doing this, I don't know. Good enough. Huh. I'm gonna have to spruce up this room another time. But hello, this is my crafting corner. This is my Nintendo Switch that obviously doesn't look like mine in real life because I have purple and orange <laughs> controllers. This is help warm my home. Oh, Eric. <laughs> I feel you. I mean, I, I tried coding a little bit before. Like when I was taking computer sciences in, in high school. I know the feeling of losing brain cells in sanity over trying to make a string of code work. And it not working for whatever reason. It's annoying. <laughs> also, this is this is my uh, clothing corner. Why do I have this? Why do I have this thing? Ah, no, not the succulent. I I just wanted to get rid of that thing. Thank you, Dad Apron. No. Hang on wall. Excellent. You found the bot, congratulations. And now I put the succulent plant back because... How dare my feeble village hands not work for <laughs> dreams. Place item. There we go. Oh, by the way, you can uh, get this recipe. You've, you've just got to f collect, I think, a, a can from the river or whatever. Like, basically a piece of trash. <laughs> and then you should get the idea to make stuff with it. And I know the succulent is something you can't do. Where, where do you wander off to? Where do you wander off to? Hello there! I wonder if God read Yoshi. Sorry if I call you Yoshi, it's a little bit of a mouthful. <laughs> Hello! Welcome in. I am Arashi. Pleasure to meet ya. Give you one guess. <gasps> Did it hide inside of you? Red Yoshi's fine? Okay. I got you. Red Yoshi. <laughs> We're chilling a little bit today. Bless some Animal Crossing. Just kind of hanging out. Doing whatever. <laughs> Today's a good day, so I'm streaming today. You're playing Animal Crossing as well? Neat! <gasps> Snowflake! Sorry. <laughs> Sorry if I screamed in your ears. 
They wandered back to your channel. What? I don't know. Maybe it reset or something. 2,645 hours? What? My dude. I only have like a... I don't know. Maybe like a couple hundred hours in this game. That's nuts, though. I applaud you for the dedication. I... My... What was your first Animal Crossing game? If, if anyone's able to answer that question. You too, Red Yoshi. You're welcome to answer. Your island theme is playable Mario Party. You can actually play it. Dude, that's cool. For me, I'm just kind of letting wherever my artist mind takes me. So, if I think, hmm, you know what? I want to make a garden here. I'm going to do that. <laughs> Over on, on your channel. It went back there. Oh, that's funny. Yeah, I briefly remember you working on it. I don't think you stream too often, so I was only able to catch it, like, a little bit. I do remember lurking for you. I hear a snowflake in the distance, and it's driving me insane. <laughs> All you need is your home on the mountain, and everyone else is on the bottom. Oh, boy. <laughs> Actually, I plan on moving mine to the top of, of the hill. Oh. Right, Nook Miles. Gimme. I would have more Nook Miles, but I... I bought the thing that gives me more pocket space. Yeah, you showed it. Oh yeah. <laughs> Dude, my memory is like so spotty on this because uh, I don't know. It's just we we don't hang out too often. I think that's why. Put away. Can I put it down, please? Place item. There we go. Give you two minutes. It'll be fixed. Take your time, my dude. It's all right. Snowflake. Snowflake must have. I love catching these snowflakes. You don't understand. <laughs> oh, wait. I completely forgot. I needed to go back inside. Like, I was inside for a reason. I got completely sidetracked talking to you guys. <laughs> it's fine. Oh! Snowflakes! My ADHD is on pure serotonin right now. No, oh, come back! Issue! And that's minus two to the durability of a flimsy nut. Oh well. Aside from, like, the minus two for. Uh, it's just a snowflake. Are you kidding me? I can graph so much stuff with that. Are you kidding me? Look at this. Look at this. <laughs> also, I'm moving the, the pockets. Uh, you know, funny enough, this, this air circulator right here looks almost identical to the one I have IRL on. <laughs> the only difference is this one has gray fans on it and, and mine has black. <laughs> I'm going to craft more Zen fencing. I really like how it looks. Also, don't mind me hoarding beautiful wrapping paper. Huh. <laughs> Your my yours is metal. What's metal? What your net? I want to unfavorite this for now, just so that way it doesn't annoy me. My wheel. Also, I want to sell this to thank you, Dad Apron, because what's the point of me holding on to it? Red wrapping paper. Telescope. I need to. Oh yeah, that's right. I need to figure out a way, some place to put it. Yay! We got puzzle deck. Now you guys get to try it out. Hey, Eric, would you like to do the honors and, and show them how it works? I mean, <laughs> it's your bot after all, so I figured you'd be excited to tell them all about it.
Huh? Ryan, I... Oh, you're talking about the fan. I'm sorry, I missed the message above. <laughs> it's alright. I mean, I try to keep up with chat, but I'm like trying to balance between talking to you guys and playing and also just having fun and letting my ADHD run wild. Honestly, I think sandbox games are so good for like those with like neuro who are neurodivergent because it, it just allows you to run wild and do things wherever which way you want to do it. I think that's great for anybody, really. But like especially those who struggle with <laughs> with doing things the supposed normal way. Because there's no wrong answer necessarily in an open sandbox game you just do things however which way you want to <laughs> use power world hey everyone has their own game right i was on minecraft earlier uh building my home and i've been getting my creativity on with the like the cherry wood the, you know the cherry wood blocks because i've never worked with them before but i tell you what though I especially love working with basalt blocks and calcite. Some of my most favorite blocks in the game, aside from like blackstone and lanterns. I I just love the color, the coloring and the textures. <laughs> you hardly ever finishing a finish a coding project, my dude. I have like five million art projects started. None of which are finished. But I tell you what, though. I, if I ever get commissioned for something, though, I, I can do commissions for you. <laughs> I will finish them. Because I... Listen, with just, like, casual, like, art projects, I do. I do them at my own pace. But with, like, a commission, per se, I will make sure it gets done. Because, hello, people are waiting on that. <laughs> And I do not want to disappoint in the slightest. Friend request received. <gasps> oh, it's MP! Never finished your, your game, Cyan? It's okay. Just take your time with it. I do commissions fast? Oh, <laughs> thank you. Honestly, I think it's a combination of... I don't want it to take too long, but at the same time, once I get an idea and I get the itch of inspiration, I just run with it. Speaking of which, I need to, uh, I need to get a cord that allows me to stream Procreate from my tablet to OBS. So, so you guys can watch me do this stuff. Puzzle deck is mostly finished. Nice. Actually, uh... Eric, did you make a help command for the puzzle deck? I think you did. I just forget what it is. Mostly finished means it is finished. Yeah, aka a coder saying it's good enough. <laughs> All the requirements you've been given are done? Okay. I'd say apart from like bug fixes, it's pretty much good to go. What is it? Puzzle? What is it? I forget because I don't use it often. I want to show you guys how to use it so... So you guys can use it whenever you want. Hey, any new stuff? Uh, yeah, that's right. I haven't really thought of anything or tried brainstorming to be honest. But, tell you what guys. If you got any suggestions for Eric on like what to include in the bot aside from like mini whirl or or hangman you are more than welcome to help that to, to, to help him yes <laughs> to tell him as well and um you're in the discord too right eric pretty sure you are but you guys can include that in like community suggestions which is a channel in there it, it's for anything that's got to do with with the the, the channel the community Etc. Like, if you got, like, suggestions on how to improve anything at all, you're more than welcome to. I mean, not just improvement, but also to include stuff. Because 
I, I cannot stress it enough, guys, that I love interacting with you all. I may be a socially anxious being, but I love developing that community and just that feeling of, oh, I just want to hug you guys every day or something like that. <laughs> Not that you guys would want to hug every single day, but it... it okay, now I'm going off on a tangent. <laughs> but you see what I mean? It's just... I, I, I'd like to foster a, a positive community that just makes me smile. And makes everyone else smile, too. You, you don't need no huggies. Oh, <laughs> it's okay, Cyan. I, we can give you cookies instead. I, I know food is a lot of people's love language. <laughs> yeah, it, if, if you got any suggestions or whatever, you can pass them on to me or Eric. Either of us works. Because, uh... Eric here is our coder slash programmer friend and likes doing and likes doing those like little projects. So honestly, anything will help him sharpen his skills and I want to see him succeed in life. Puzzle deck. There's a tambourine. I'm like half tempted to get it. I don't know if I'll ever have a musician room, but, um, I would like it for my catalog. <laughs> What's going on with the, with the, with the bot? I don't know. Oh, it's always good to get refreshing done. <gasps> oh, right, 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 right. There's this actually, there's this game dev I've been watching a lot for like the past several weeks, maybe months. <laughs> he, he, uh, his channel is called Pirate Software. I know, funny name, right? And the, the dev's name is Thor. I would recommend you seek out that Twitch channel. Wait, you know him? Wait, do you watch him too? But he, 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 has, he has a lot of access to different resources and, and links to free things that you guys can use to go make your own things. It can be games, it can be music, it can be all sorts of things. He's, he's even got a Discord. Yeah, the ex-Blizzard ex guy. He also um, worked in like department, to, uh, he worked for the government at some point for it, like hacking power plants to check him for vulnerabilities and stuff. And he's got like three black badges as well, which is like, they, it, it's like medals of honor in the hacking world, I think, in, in the general gist of it. And he's got resources, he's got, he can point you to uh, sites that can allow you to learn how to hack legally as well. And I s emphasis on legally because you do not want to be doing that illegally. <laughs> but, but that should be given, honestly. He, he's got so many resources. I'm actually thinking of joining his Discord so I can... Yeah, white hat hacking. I remember learning about that in my cybersecurity class in high school. It's basically, it's basically legal hacking allows you to find vulnerabilities and people will pay you for finding those vulnerabilities. As long as you're doing it legally, of course. I have a mod load with one with exclamation mark puzzle puzzle. Um, puzzle. Ah, there we go. Yeah, if you, for, for, you know, <laughs> English, I'm trying to figure out what to say. For puzzle deck commands, guys, just at puzzle deck, and it'll bring up all the commands that you can look at. And, <laughs> of course, obviously that doesn't work, but you can use any of these commands for help and put in a puzzle feel free to try one out guys the brain is failing too many words okay available puzzles hangman and wordle <laughs> it's okay cyan don't don't let your brain fry too much learning a little bit per day is excellent but you don't have to overload your brain in one day trying to learn something Learning one thing a day. 
should be a good general goal for any of us, to be honest. Just one thing. Doesn't have to be like a crazy amount of things, like I said. Wait a second, I can... Wait a second, I can play with this? Which doesn't like new lines? New lines? What new lines? Do, you ha do I have all the fruit, all the fossils? I do not have all the fossils, but I do have a bunch. I'm trying to think of all the fruit I have. I know I have, I do not have persimmons. Or per persimmons or however you pronounce it. I do not have those. Well, I should write down what I have. I know I have cherries. Those are my signature island food. I have oranges. I have peaches. Pears. Uh, coconuts. You don't- you don't even think you have those? <laughs> well, my trees are growing those back right now. But I- I can get you some of those. Oh yeah, I think I have apples as well. Oh yeah, uh, well, what's confusing you, Cyan? Is it me saying all these fruits or was it something I said before? Oh yeah, that's right, Eric. Which, why can't you just appreciate the enterkey for once? Let's see. What other fruits I have? I do not have bananas. If persimmons exist in this game like they did in New Leaf, I do not have them. Lychees or lychees? I, I don't know how you pronounce it. I do not have those. Uh, sorry, senpai. <laughs> oh yeah, would you guys like to see my museum? I it's it's still a work in progress, obviously, because I haven't gotten everything. You see, this is the picky guy I made today. You're just an old soul, huh? Is that all you gotta say? There's a lot of foreign fruit, yeah. I can't wait to have a bridge. It'll make it things so much easier. The only bridge on my island is the one that's like right south of my house. <laughs> Apples, pears, cherries, peaches, oranges, and coconuts. You were asking about the main six. Yes, I, I do have apples, pears, I do have cherries. That's my signature island food. Peaches, I do have those. Oranges as well and coconuts, yes. Look at this! <laughs> Is that all I can do with it? Yeah, tambourine. To be honest, I wasn't expecting that. <laughs> oh yeah, I need to put this wasp nest away. What is going on with... That's very kind of you, senpai. I better just mod Eric. <laughs> do, do, do you need that to get the stuff done, Eric? If, if so, I will. I will do it so he, <laughs> so he can get it done. I, I would hate to uh, keep you from it. Also, 
bot was built to be run by mods. You have a point. Add, what was it? Mod? It's been a while since I modded somebody. Okay, you've got moderator privileges. Okay, aside from th that little fiasco with pulse that going on, this is this is the flag, guys. This is my flag. I made this myself. <laughs> Do I accept the friend request? No, I haven't. You have sword now. Watch out! Oh no, Eric's a uh, Eric's a dangerous man now. <laughs> Uh, hold on one second. Add friend. That's a wild senpai. Oh, you have Isabel as your profile picture. You must really love Animal Crossing. <laughs> oh, we got Wordle going. Cool. Oh yeah, Eric, uh, are the others able to s guess? You, you didn't program in a non-mod response to it. Uh, anyone can guess. Okay, yes. So mods just gotta like start it or they, oh wait, no, no, no. Can anyone start it? Only mods can load start and stop puzzles. Oh so yeah, if a, oh, yeah. actually should we change that to where like anyone can start it? But there's like a a cooldown between commands because uh yeah, I should just ask you guys straight up. Would you guys like to have access to it to where you guys can play it whenever you want instead of having to ask a mod to do it? That way, that way we don't forget it, ex it exists. <laughs> Would you guys like that? I think it'd make a little more sense. I can't remember exactly why I had it restricted before. But yeah, what do you think, guys? Did someone abuse the command before? Not to my knowledge. You know what? How about we do... Probably in our DM somewhere. Hey, Eric. How about we try to do a test run to see how the community fares with having access to it without having... You know, just without having a mod start it. It's been that way since the start. Mm. Oh, yeah. It's because we were doing testing and we just never changed it. And I never really bothered to ask to change it. Yeah, Eric's just the dev. Would you be able to, Eric, to, you know, to make sure, like, even the chatters can have access to it, not just mods. So they can, like, start and start a game whenever they want. Do I have all the veggies? No, I do have pumpkins, sugarcane, and potatoes. But I do not have tomatoes, wheat, and carrots. I keep forgetting to put the wasp nest away. Wasp nests are good for making medicine. I think, wait, do you also need wheat? Clumps of weeds? Yeah, that's right. You you still you still got class stuff to do, huh? I just leave my wasp nest here on the beach. <laughs> I should put them away, huh? Just so someone can't just like kick them off my beach or whatever. I usually play solo, and not really let much of anybody come on my island, so that's why I just tend to leave it out. The six more months. Six more months until you graduate, or until you like finish the year off. One, two, three, four. 
It's a four-lettered word. <laughs> well, congratulations, Eric. Hang in there. You're almost finished. Well, you're halfway finished, I think. <laughs> you graduate in six months. That's epic. And then you get to go back to to the job you really liked, huh? The one where everyone was... Everyone's like very sad you're you left and I think you generally like that that dev team, huh? Because all because uh, I mean from what you've told me you've you've heard good things. Oh Yeah, uh, what does the asterisk mean? Eric does it means like it, it's the correct letter, but the wrong placing right? And the dashes mean it's not the correct letter. Oh, uh, yeah, that's right. <gasps> Eric, you're such an amazing coder. Keep at it, my dude. Stupid mole cricket. Oh, come on. You programmed in the how to play. Dude, that's epic. <laughs> I can't be excited to see this bot be more be used more by you guys. Do you have all the different colors of pumpkins? No, I only have orange. Just regular plain old orange. Oh yeah, I, I did. I did try telling you guys about the flag. I I designed this myself. And and the name of my island is Cheshire. I I tried thinking of a good island name because uh, my my island signature fruit is cherries. And now that I think about it, the name also reminds me of like the the Cheshire cat, you know. <laughs> Well, thank you, senpai. Oh yeah, just let me know when I gotta open my gate for you. <laughs> okay, <laughs> that works. Telescope. Drag it over. Spin it around. Does that look any good? Eh. Let me go up the ladder. Thank you. That's a lot of haze. I'd say banana, but that's one letter too much. <laughs> Maybe I could put it by the campsite. The, the telescope. I'm gonna do that. Place item. There we go. That looks like a little smidge more proper campsite. Come back here! Ah, yeah! Please stop missing. Thank you. Is it Coco? Like C O C O A. Because it does have an A in it. Favorite. I'm gonna put that there. Nope. Oh yeah, 
that I, I just remembered something I was gonna show you guys where I, I thought of moving my home to. Okay, open up. Oh, oh okay. Right, right, right. Oh, in times like these, I wish I had a fast travel. <laughs> uh, I'm on my way to the airport, Sunblight. Warp pipes? Wait, those are a thing? Wait, those are a thing? What? I, I mean, I would be happy to have one to test it out. I want visitors. I think it's online play, right, Senpai? Because, uh... <laughs> Is there not really anybody close to me? Not that I'm aware of, anyways. All of my friends, only my best friends, by the Adoto code. Oh, okay. Got you, Senpai. I wonder what the word is. Hey, there we go. Hey, you guys solved it. <laughs> nice work. Something in the English language, Cyan. I don't know. <laughs> Close the window. Oh. I remember when we were working on it, we, we just scoured for like all the five lettered words we could possibly have. <laughs> Deserted Island Dollar. Senpai Land, so original. <laughs> From the Scrabble Dictionary. Ah, oh, right. Chat AI. No, no cheating. I don't think Dodos can fly, can they? Unless they're extinct. Except in game. Empire Island. Whoa, look at that gorgeous woman. <laughs> yeah, for Wordle, we essentially pulled up like all the five lettered words we could possibly get from Scrapple. <laughs> oh, that's the bad things, oh boy. Post the most. Look at that, I got stamps. You kind of cheated. Okay, it makes no sense. <laughs> Wee! Look at that. With ZL. 
Oh, yes. Of course I want to be best friends with Sinpi. Wee! Look at this! I, I guess I should g give you a t tour? Yes, a little. <laughs> Uh, I, I, I guess we go out. <laughs> I'm so awkward with guests. I can talk to you guys fine, but the second I have to deal with a guest, it's like, oh, what am I supposed to do? I don't know what I'm gonna do. Help! Oh, hello, this is the garden I made recently. I just put walls around it. I usually craft here. And this is my home. For now, I'm thinking of moving it. Your own chat GPT. <laughs> Wait, can she come in here? Yes, she can. There's not much in here for now, but it is what it is. Yeah. By the way, I hope you have a fun time in the bathroom. <laughs> it's that way. <laughs> I hope you enjoy a masked face just staring at you while you're trying to pee. <laughs> Of them over. <laughs> oh. Oh yeah, it's right. You're trying to guess the word. Do I, do I want to bother going in there just to make sure she's okay? No. <laughs> <laughs> Hard, hardest part is probably communicating the arguments for the, for a chat command. Yeah, that's right. Hmm. Senpai, are you okay in there? I'm confused by that, that emo. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna walk in. <laughs> oh, you're just sitting on the floor. <laughs> Staring into the mask's face. And now I'm just staring at you. Oh no! Sparkles! Run! <laughs> oh yeah, I, I should show uh, everybody the... My museum. My museum is up to the northeast. I do not have a bridge to it just yet. I'm I'm working on I'm working slowly. Wait, wait, oh okay. I'm waiting. Yes. Oh well, wow. fossils. <laughs> That's three. Hey, tomato! Welcome in, buddy! It's good to see you! Three, four, five, six. I have six fossils? Are you, are you sure I can just have these? 
I know you said you brought these for me, but... <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, fair enough, senpai, since you have all of them. Sippy sippy, okay. Okay, let's go. <gasps> Snowflake! I hate when it hides behind a tree like that. I can't see! It's probably gone. Yep, there it goes. Well. If you need a waltzing pole, just let me know. I have the itch to get that snowflake. A roundabout way. It'll, it'll take longer though. <laughs> you have a vaulting pole or no? If not, I, I can show you the roundabout way. You left all your equipment at home? <laughs> all, right, all right, okay. I'll, I'll take you the roundabout way. It, it's longer, but it'll get you there all the same. We must traverse through the mountains. <laughs> okay. That's the very picky snowman. I have ladders. Whee! Escort the senpai. What is... What is that word? There isn't an M. Time to cheat. What? <laughs> Whoa, no cheating. This is like taking the back roads in West Virginia. <laughs> Just windy roads. Voila, here we are. I seriously need to build that bridge. But I need to finish the current one that's being built first. <laughs> Hello, blathers. Assess fossils. Now let's see if we got anything new. Yes. Hey, we got something. Something not put yet part of my collection yet, senpai. Of course I'm gonna donate blathers. I wanna be a completionist with my fossils. Yeah, fun fact, in, in New Leaf, I actually completed my entire fossil collection. I think it took me a couple years, but I managed to make it. Vif, I've never even heard of that word. Oh, Treshar is a wizard. Oh, that's why I can't donate. It's because I have a visitor. I can't donate a fossil. I think I finished the Megalo completely, though. 
I think I know for a fact I have a dinosaur track. I finished the T-Rex. Wetzel wing. This is where my fossils shall be. I, I I actually wanted to take everybody on a tour through through my collections. You'll have to go before three. <laughs> hey, that works out for me too, cause uh, my pap has gotta swing by around three. You're done. Your 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 brain's kind of bleh. <laughs> I, I totally get you, senpai. Because I, I, I might have to leave at three as well. What don't I have here? I have the ammonite. Trilobite. Anomalocaris. Or Karis. I don't know. When. I am not going to try pronouncing that. Do I get back to your lab? Thank you for the wishes, Eric. Have fun with it, okay? May, may uh, take away a few brain cells every now and then, but it's very rewarding. <laughs> okay, Eric. Thank you. I might as well just keep him as a moderator. <laughs> just so he can help more directly with the bot stuff. Uh, maybe I can ask him later. Uh, Eric, are you, are you okay with doing mod stuff? Cause um, I I, I just don't want to mod you without like <laughs> without any consent, you know. May want to come outside for a sec. Okay. Are you willing to uphold the mod duties of this channel, uphold the rules, and do the mod work? Well, yeah, it's just... It, ma major reason was... I, I just didn't want to shove it onto you. That's why I, that's why I felt hesitant. Okay, so you're okay with it then. As long as you're okay with it. And you will actually try try to do some mod duties, then I'm happy. That's a lot of stuff. Are you sure about this? What? Dude, you can realize how many rooms I can get with all this? You know how I was laughing about it possibly having a sugar mom earlier? Well, uh, I don't even have any debts in Animal Crossing. I paid off my load in full. But I, this will be more than enough for my next expansion. Weeds. Sandy beach flooring. Actually, I think I have, I think I have the recipe for that. Thank you, Winter. Thank you for getting rid of the bot. You've got to be kidding me. This is so much here. This is going to take me a hot minute to, like, put away. <laughs> uh... Winter's getting creative with the with the bot ban reasons. Yeah, there's this there's this bot called Donk Seven, and and reason, kind of close to being Doink, but it's a bot so ban. <laughs> Wait, how much can I hold in my pockets? Oh, you gotta you gotta go simply. That's okay. Thank you for just being incredibly generous. You can't be kidding me. Oh, oops. Uh, 
I'll be sure to try and repay you back one day. MK did for you too? Sheesh. Okay. My inventory is so stuffed, even with expanded pockets. <laughs> I think I have to release the paper kite butterfly. Uh, I'm legit gonna have to run to the APD now. <laughs> Pockets are so stuffed. <laughs> you know, unironically, days before my birthday, choose some pie. <laughs> it's actually quite timely. Have fun, Senpai. Don't get too dragged down by adulting. You go poof. <laughs> What a legend. <laughs> Saving, do not touch. But what if I want to touch? I, I, I will need to close my gates. What, to do anything? I might be right about that. You know, I'll just do it. Because I know that they tend to restrict you on some island activities while the gates are open. <sighs> Your bots are gone? Excellent. Thank you, Winter. I always appreciate the bot cleanup. Only a few designated bots are spared from the... from... from Mod Wrath. <laughs> Please close the gate. Stop communication and close the gate? Yes, I would like that. Thank you, Orville. Okay, no. <laughs> uh, they annoy you when you're trying to look through the list. That's fair enough, honestly. Uh, you, guys, you don't have to resort to viewer bots. Just lurking with your main account is perfectly fine. And you can have multiple tabs open as well. I don't understand why people feel the need to make viewer bots. Uh, they're like, oh, but, 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 I, I want to get these people to XX amount of viewers and, and get them to like, I don't know, like, Affiliate or partner like dude you can do that with your main account. You don't need mo you don't need bots to do it Get your friends even Don't have any friends get your family members get people you know There's all sorts of content out there for all sorts of people and there are all sorts of people who can watch those all sorts of people bots are not necessary To, to increase viewer count To, to give people views for themselves. Not to troll some people, I don't know. <sighs> yeah, but that's the thing. Like, if you want to give people views, you can just do it with your regular account. <laughs> that's like completely unnecessary to make a bot account. For, for that specific reason, to give views. Now I'm a millionaire. Look at me go. My internet mom stopped by and helped me. <laughs> oh yeah, I actually would like to take a look at the Nook shopping since it's a new day. That means I can get more furniture and stuff. Because right now, in the Nook store, there's not really much for me to get. 
that I would like for my home. Beyond our understanding, they just exist, I guess. Digital scale. I mean, that would make sense in a bathroom. Um... I I'd say you go ahead and get your food, Winter, if it's already ready. If anything, you can always wrap it up and put it in the fridge. Because I, I would not recommend leaving any food out. For fear of gnats or letting the food spoil. It, I, I'd say at least take care of it. Even if you're not necessarily hungry. I mean, like, just, like, take care of it and put it away or whatever. It's like a meal prep bowl from the store. <laughs> Not enough bells. Digital scale. Ooh. That sofa looks really nice. The couch. Floor lights. These are... I mean, I could put a partition in that bathroom. Get an ironing set. As well. Nintendo Switch is just as expensive in, in Animal Crossing world as it is IRL. Oh, that actually, that would look good in a bathroom. This thing right here. A towel basket. Gotta have a towel basket or at least some place where you can hang up your towels. <laughs> Rice cooker. I can hear certain people screaming for it. Yeah, it's always good to have, like, those things you can easily prepare or just shove in the microwave. Our toy tool shelf. What other things do I have in here? Hmm. Yeah, this is why I like buying items, even though I don't necessarily need them. It's so I can catalog them, and if I ever do need them in the future, it's it's just there in the catalog. Like, I don't have to hoard the item. It's just here. You get back to eat healthier meals? My dude, I feel you there. I've been on the struggle bus with trying to get myself back to... Just getting myself into a healthy state, you know? Better sleep, better eating habits, so on and so forth. Because, eh, I'll be honest with my own weaknesses. I haven't been the best with remembering to eat or remembering to get to sleep on time. And <laughs> my emotions haven't been too good either. But, you know what? I actually had two good nights of sleep lately. And I tell you what, I feel so good just from two good nights rest. Sleep on time, what's that? Something that'll actually give you more energy in the morning, <laughs> actually. In addition to giving yourself your body fuel. If, if you struggle to eat like I do, then just getting something in your system is better than nothing. Because eventually you're gonna, you're gonna run out of energy. And how can you do things that you want to do or help people if you're out of that energy, you know? You need to get rid of the sand in your boxing bag. Huh? Fill it up with this removable gel and then use it. 
after removing excess stress and energy when needed. Plus, cold showers are nice after a workout. Yeah, fair enough. I tend to like a warm shower, to be honest, but like a cold shower is nice. Oh, uh, every now and then, honestly. I, I don't like ma purposely making myself cold, so I don't tend to go for them very often. But there are a couple occasions where I'm like, oh, it feels so good. Especially like when you're extremely overheated. Having a nice cold shower is so good. I, I, yeah, I can actually, I can see why people would want to have a cold shower after a workout is because you're you're sweating and you're super hot from like a workout and working those muscles. So I can see why. Yeah, I can I can see the appeal. It's just not necessarily my type of appeal. When you're anxious, you are upset or stressed, getting rid of energy like that helps me. Yeah, fair enough. Especially if no one sees me. <laughs> Tell you what though, I do not fault you for that. Sometimes the best way to de-stress is uh, just taking time to yourself. Honestly. How much am I gonna spend? I think... 15,000 maybe? Cold showers in that degree weather? Yes. <laughs> oh, dude, it reminds me. It reminds me of like a super hot day I had at band camp. It was like 90 degrees uh, Fahrenheit, which is just a little bit above the 34 degrees Celsius that you mentioned. Just like a smidge, but essentially the same thing. There was no cloud coverage, no breeze, and we were expected to train and march around in it on, on the practice field <laughs> for several hours that day. I felt like I was dying. And I tell you what, I would have thrown up if I, if I didn't have water to save my sorry butt. Tell you what though, those four years of, like, band camp has taught me the value, the true value of water and hydrating and making sure you're fed. Although, I'm not... <laughs> uh, especially, yeah, that one time at band camp. Who oh boy. At least half of us in the arts department have that story. Got super tan from that. Oh yeah, it reminds me. Never go without sunblock. Ever. Ever. You, you, think, you, you, you think you don't tan easily, think again. You'll roast like a lobster. It's like it's like someone uh, su sh sh suddenly shoved you alive and in, into a boiling hot pot of water, and then you suddenly become red and hurting, and you want you're screaming to get out of that hot. So, hydrate or dehydrate, guys, and don't forget your sunblock. I would, I would, I would at least recommend like fifty degree fifty. F SF or higher, honestly. Especially if you burn easy. I I tend to go for like at least like seventy to hundred. You're in a band soon. You're an art student, and you doodled. Could have been a theater kid. At some point, never got the chance. Fair enough. I was also a photography kid. Honestly, it's kind of cool. I'd say even for the people who don't burn easily, it's still good to wear sunblock because, well, <laughs> the sun can still damage your skin over time, even though you may not burn necessarily, because hello sun rays and how they work. <laughs> You're in a firefighter club and those are, <sighs> I, I don't envy you. Firefighters? My, my, I, I salute you guys. Thank you for being out there. I, I do not envy you and having to run into fiery buildings and having to take care of all these things that a civilian normally doesn't take care of. 
uh, like emergency wise without like you know the proper stuff like you, that what am i saying <laughs> firefighters have that level of equipment that that can deal with like severe things that us civilians cannot hey hey at least you know how to handle a fire that's good yeah Yeah, you know, fun fact, Winter. I, I was a soccer player at some point. Yeah. When I was a kid, I played soccer. Uh, outdoor recreational soccer. I... I think I was a pretty good defender for my age. Although... I remember I quit being goalie because I would be too afraid of the ball flying at my face. And, and getting hurt, you know? Oh, Winter. <laughs> I would have been interested in Firefighter Club, but would have regretted it, probably. Most likely. <laughs> yeah, firefighting's not for everybody. You, you've got to have nerves of steel for that. And honestly, I'd say it makes me respect... Respect firefighters more. Because they got to save lives and put up with all... Uh, put up with all this stupid civilian shenanigans. Jump from high places? Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Dude. My my legs turn to jelly when I'm looking over the railing on a stairwell. I do not think I would do well with heights. Unless I'm properly secured and know for a fact I won't just fall and go splat and die. Because, um... If I don't feel secure at heights, I, I, I'm going to I'm gonna have like an anxiety attack or have my legs turn to jelly. So I have a fear of heights, but to a certain extent. Your dad was, your dad was your soccer coach? Oh boy. Well, I can, uh, I bet for a fact that you've been fit during that period of time in your life. Yeah, that changes the perspective a lot. <coughs> Buff winter. Strunk, beefy. Yeah, I hear military training is rough. <laughs> Plenty of stories. About like waking up at like butt crack of dawn just to go for a run or whatever, several miles worth, and barely getting any sleep. Like you only get a couple hours before you got to get up again. Oh boy, no, I would die from that. Uh. <laughs> Earning set. Old-fashioned wash tub. Wait, I had this at some point. Wait, no, this is a craftable. Winter wasn't buff. Winter had high stamina and could outrun every sing every everyone in gym because you're endurance behind. Something tells me you would have aced the pacer test. Uh, and of course, it involves some speed, but uh, like having that speed. But you're especially gonna have to have the endurance for it if you hope to get like. High amounts of those in there. You're too lazy for that? <laughs> Fair enough. Honestly. I think the... I can't remember the highest I've gotten. But I remember I was one off from the maximum I could get. In uh, middle school. Like one of the years I did it. Uh, I just wish I was able to get that last one in. Oh, it felt so good. There was only there was one person who was able to get every single one of them up to that the, up to that maximum. It was, it was me and that person that took the top two. Honestly, even though I felt like I was dying afterwards, I was pretty proud of myself. Of course, if I tried doing that now, I would die. After like 10 laps, maybe. <laughs> Remember seeing two kids getting in the 60s in the face of high school. 
Honestly, that's some pretty good. Uh, is there something I'm missing here? Oh yeah, I need a, a digital st scale. Show offs? I never really tried to show off, to be honest. I just tried to do my best. Tried to do as many as I could. But that one year I managed to pull that off, I felt pretty proud. Honestly, I really would like this double sofa. Look at it, it looks so good. <laughs> yeah, I, I mean, you gotta thank the people who, who go out of their way to do their ridiculous amount, because it allows you to reap the benefits to an extent. You just aim to barely pass because you're too lazy for it. <laughs> Fair enough, honestly. Imperial partition. Okay, there we go. I think that's everything for the bathroom. Also, I didn't count how many I did, uh, I ordered, but I'm assuming it's close to max or at max because you can only order a max of five per day. Anyone drop stuff yet? No. Oh, hold on, I got, I gotta take a call.
true. Okay, uh, I, I'm going to be taking a couple more minutes because my pop is going to be coming in to help me with my window that I mentioned <laughs> earlier. You've got to put some window blinds in and take out the the broken panel, uh, the broken glass pane. So I got to move my art tote and stuff so that way he can have direct access to my window more easily, more readily. And um, I, I might have to mute at some point because uh, it might get a little noisy when he does get here. And he also might talk to me as well. <laughs> Uh, so I don't know if he's gonna say my real name or not by accident. But yeah, I'll be I'll be back in a few minutes.
Alrighty, guys. Oh, I accidentally put on my headphones backwards. Whoops. He is working on my window a little bit right now, so... Well, fair warning if you hear some noises in the background. <laughs> Time to get myself all cozy again. Thank you for welcoming me back. <laughs> Construction ASMR. Oh, well, hey, at least it's not the annoying drill stuff. That stuff's awful right here. That's annoying. Now, fun fact, my headphones don't necessarily block out all the noise around me. It only partially does. But it's fine because my house is usually quiet. Blech. Now I can move. <laughs> Alright. Back to what I was doing. Oh. Feels like I got eyelash in my eye. Really? Alright, we're good. <laughs> I think I should go to Blathers first. Before I try selling anything. Like any of the fossils, for example. Because there are some in, in the... In a collection, uh, collection of, of random fossils that there'd be RB. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Oops. Thank you, but uh, like as I was saying, it, there are some from the random assortment of fossils that Senpai gave me that are not part of my collection. So I just gotta make sure that those are combed out first. Okay. What you doing? Uh, don't, okay, you're just gonna run off like that? Got it. <laughs> Dogs are happy my path up's here.
The chaos has been quelled for now. <laughs> Kind of warm outside. It's 58 degrees. You can't be kidding me. Okay, back to the game. There we go. <laughs> I had to make sure the dogs weren't gonna get in, just in case, you know, glass spilled, or whatever. And I was had to help my pet up real quick, but I'm back. Seems like I might be able to go past three. It's just, you know, just with some minor interruptions. I would like to donate bladders. Oh, there's two. Two out of six, I believe. Thank you, senpai. So kind of her. <laughs> That's it for now. We can just go ahead and sell everything else. Well, plant some of that stuff and sell the rest of the fossils I don't need. Move over there. Didn't I already learn this recipe? Yeah, I did. I do appreciate Senpai giving it to me, though. Maybe I can give it to someone who doesn't already possess it. I swing by here. I, I usually donate a little bit. <laughs> sure, I'll help. I'll just donate 150. I, I tend to take whatever is like on the right side of that co that co comma and just give it to Lloyd. Like every time I pass by, well, almost every time. I mean, I could easily pay off that bridge now if I wanted to, thanks to Senpai. But, you know, I'm gonna... I'm not gonna rush it. I should further that garden area I have. Not this one, but another one I have. I'm gonna need that watering can. Yeah, that's a- I think that's the first metal one I ever made. The reason why it hasn't broke yet is because I don't use it often. <laughs> Alright, let's book it over. Oh. Hi, I see you're finally starting to melt. Little jerk. <laughs> I need to put a ladder here since I always try to go up this way. This is the garden area I'm trying to start. Alright, where is my shovel? I need my shovel. Put here tomatoes, carrots, wheat, pumpkins. Hmm. 
grew some of these weeds. And flowers too. Just so I can give myself more garden space, so to speak. At some point, I just decided this would be my garden spot. much durability I've left on this shovel. I mean, it's lasted me for a good bit. Last there. No! I didn't want to do that! No. Not the tambourine. It's yes. Also, yes. Today is my gardening day, even though it's, in <laughs> it's almost halfway through February. <laughs> or it is halfway through. Eh, whatever. <laughs> Okay, one more white pumpkin. I wonder how Senpai managed to get all these. Maybe it's just friends coming over and giving stuff that they uncover. Maybe. <laughs> add another one there. What am I gonna do with that spare pumpkin? You'll see. <laughs> I did not want to dig there, but okay. <laughs> Let's add you there. the carrots. I I'm definitely gonna get my nook miles for these, but I'm in this. Oh, look at that. Oh, wait, no, that's, that's, no, 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 no. Nook miles. Proud out loud. Oh, got a thousand. I started planting like crazy yesterday. <laughs> like just getting a whole bunch of potatoes from Leaf. You know, that gardener sloth. But I think she only like, what, comes on Wednesdays?
I might want to do some tomatoes. Let's do some of those. some trees. I feel like I might have to at some point. Ow! <laughs> Put it back! Thank you. I'll just go ahead and put this back the way it was. I think I might put some wheat somewhere else. This is the spot I, I was trying to mention earlier that I was thinking of moving my home to. Because there's just so much space up here that I can basically customize it and make this whole my whole yard. Because it's kind of hard when you put yourself at, at a water bend. That snowflake tempts me. Time to clean up the weeds. The weeds! I have to get them all in my pocket. As if it weren't overflowing already. <laughs> to replant these pansies somewhere else. Because seriously, they're clocking up my inventory bad. <laughs> uh, you go there, you also go there. You, you as well, and you. Awfully close. It's right there. I I want I want to make sure I don't. Get it into the pond because I've done that before, New Leaf, and oh, it felt so bad. Oh, some iron nuggets. Honestly, I need more stone, not iron nuggets, but I'm not going to complain. Ah, the dogs are going nuts again.
I can finally talk again. <laughs> My pap pap was messing with the window the whole time. I was like, bang, bang, bang. And I know some of you guys wouldn't mind, but like, it's supposed to be a cozy day. <laughs> Oh, I got a little update for you guys. Uh, they, my, my pep up called in advance. So I think it was like either yesterday or like earlier in the day. Like, are you going to be open? He gets over there. Finds out they're closed. Like, oh, because of an emergency. It, 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 <laughs> you can imagine how annoying that would be. And freeing that would be. When you called in advance to make sure that they would be open at, like, a specific, at, you know, during their, like, specific hours. Because, you know, something needs fixed, right? And then that happens. <sighs> so, I've gotta wait until tomorrow. Yeah, the reason why I had to mute is because... My pep up had to put it back. Yep. But I'm back now, at least to some capacity. <laughs> Actually, I should make some more frozen fences. Because why not? I just need one more snowflake for it. Did you know that you get more bells from leaf umbrellas than you do grass skirts? <laughs> yeah. I figured that one out during selling. I forget how much you get per umbrella, but I think it's like maybe 150 per umbrella. I don't know. All right, you hooligans, let me sell to you. <laughs> Everyone needs their windows fixed. Pop in your windows. Did someone break break one of the panes or whatever? Uh, leaf umbrella. Wait, I should just sell one to see how much it is. Three hundred bells. Oh, it's, it's two times more than what I thought it was. Get 300 bells per umbrella, uh, leaf umbrella. It's getting harder to open, and you think the wheel is aged? Ah, uh, I gotcha. <laughs> yeah, the mosquito net on my window also needs replaced, because part of it's ripped. And I, w I would like the- I, I told my pap pap like, eh, it needs fixed as well. Because, mind you, it it's enough to where bugs could get in. And come summer, they're gonna be they're gonna be out in full force. And if I want my window open to keep things cool in my room, I need that mosquito net to be f <laughs> to to not have a rip in it. Even even though it's not like a major one, it's big enough to where something can get in. Cause y you know how bugs are; they're tiny. Always summer in the sea. <laughs> I feel like the wheels in my brain are turning. Like, I think I know what you're referring to. Southeast Asia? Yeah, okay, I remembered correctly. <laughs> yeah, I was trying to remember something. Like, what does that mean again? I, I, I believe I recognize it. I remember, I remember it, but I'm like... How would it refer to specifically? And I remembered. <laughs> what you doing, Sophie? I see you're staring at me. What? You, you want some pets? 
come here if you want some pets. Stop being difficult. <laughs> Yeesh, okay, you playful thing. Yes, doggos. Oh yeah, that's right, I gotta do the fish redeem. Plus I wanna get Mando off the front so she doesn't get to him. Okay, I'm gonna turn to the fish. I'm gonna tell them. Okay, it was Cyan anyway, didn't it? Fish, guess what? Cyan thinks that you clueless adorable things are adorable. I told him that they're cute. <laughs> Uh, I gotta love fish not understanding human language, but maybe it's for the better. What? You want, uh, you want me to throw the ball? Okay. Kind of straight. Okay, can you stop making it plain hard to get and let me have the ball so I can chuck it? Ah! <laughs> yeah, they are cute. I, I would say the easiest way to know what they no look like is to search up what a black neon tetra looks like. Finally, got that ball from you. Chiba got it, that's your own problem. Chiba's the other doggo. Hey, Chiba. <laughs> You're picking up Chiba's bad habits, you know? Trying to play hard to get with the ball. You want me to chuck it or not? What? You want me to throw it? You gotta give it to me. Or else I'm not gonna do it. <laughs> oh, those fishes that your cousins are also keeping? Hey, that's cool. Uh, I actually had five. Because I think... I, I, um... Accidentally got... Like, the people who, who shipped the fish accidentally gave me an extra, but, uh... Yeah, it, it, now I'm down to three because, you know, fish die every now and then. Ow, stop clawing me. <sighs> Meanie. But, uh, I think they're doing alright for three. But, I, I'd say no less than at least three because they're schooling fish. They're very social, so they like to be together. I'd say if you can't afford three, at least make sure you get two. At least make sure it has a friend. I mean, I'm no fish expert, but... Social fish need at least one other per one other of its kind in the tank. At least one other one. At least. <laughs> No, please don't keep barking in my room. No, don't start. Please. It's one thing when you bark like crazy out, out in the living room, but it's another thing when you do in my room. <laughs> yeah, your cat your cat will go nuts just to make sure it, it knows that it, you know that it's hungry. <laughs> I have six snowflakes. <laughs> okay. Finally. Tell you what. Uh, my dogs don't usually tell me when they're hungry, but I know that Sheba always lets me know. When she needs out. Sophie has her, her own way of doing it as well. But she is really hard to outstream for whatever reason. We have had her for at least a year and she still sometimes poops in the house. Sometimes pees in the house. Like, you know, we take her outside. And then she, like, turns around and does, like, the other things she didn't do outside in the house. So you can imagine how annoying that is. <laughs> so, you have to, like, stick it out. Outside to make sure she does both because she gets easily distracted like far more easily than I think Sheba even which is the Ponsky I have Ugh. It 
the closest thing you uh, the closest thing you keep for fish fish is the one story deep pond filled with black tilapia for cooking I say that that counts that's in your hometown house I see hey I mean they can be your pets they can be your food. <laughs> Although I don't think black neon tetras can be food. They're too tiny. Not that we want to eat them anyways. No, they're too cute. Mm. I should put these in my home. I managed to sell the bulk of what's what trashed my inventory. I do sometimes fry tiny fish for the fried rice. Oh, oh! Even the black neon tetras aren't safe. Oh no! I would say my fish are safe though, because I, I keep them as pets. Alright, let's see what we got this time. A pom pom sweater. What does that look like? Oh, that doesn't look too bad. I I wear the wetsuit all the time though, so it's it, it's like one less inventory space I gotta deal with. Plus it allows me to, to like get, get into the water. The ocean water. Not having to change. I'm for the snowflake to leave. Aha! No! You jerk! Yeah, sometimes you do need to get keep the fish down. Completely fair to be honest. Gotta do what you gotta do. Why am I taking the long way to my Okay, no I'm not. Yes I am, no I'm not I you know what? I'm not gonna confuse myself. It's for the afternoon, I don't feel like confusing myself. <laughs> I just ran past my house. What? I, I don't know. I forget what I said. There we go. Got the Oh yeah, I was talking about getting my home. <laughs> about 5 a.m. Yeah, you're on the other side of the world, buddy. I hope you at least got some sleep, though. Put this in storage. Put this in storage. And this. And this, I guess. I don't know what I'm gonna do with bamboo pieces, but I know it's for a recipe. I need to like put a proper table in the middle. Because I've been using cardboard boxes. Then <laughs> uh, nap at 8 p.m. Okay. <laughs> just, just doing the wellness check. I care about other people. Okay, now I'll just see about- Hey there, Milo! How are you today? We're chilling with some Animal Crossing. I 
was just kind of doing whatever. Today's a good day. Good, that's good. <laughs> Starflakes! I love them to bait pieces! They're easy to catch and, and easy to sell. Especially if you pick up some recipes for it. Eee! More of them! Gimme. Uh. Oh, yeah, sorry, I was gonna. Go over here. Oh, oh I hear a snowflake. <laughs> I was gonna, I was gonna go over here to see about moving my house, but uh, <laughs> I got distracted by the snowflake again. Wait, can you blame me? All the snow stuff and horizons looks very pretty. Hello. Yes. Okay, yes, yes, Tom. I know how a campsite works. We're playing Town of Salem, too. Cool, cool. Uh, about my home, I, I, I think. Can, can I relocate it? By the following morning. 8,000 bells. Well, at least that's not as pricey as an, as an expansion, so... I'll take it. I need to rope off the area, yeah, yeah, yeah. I love how I just said I kept... Uh, I'll keep thinking... I kept... I, I'm just, like, repeatedly thinking about it. And then... I did all that gardening, I'm like, well, I guess I'm moving now. <laughs> it's just there's more space up on that mount, uh, that hilltop or mountaintop or whatever you call it. And more space to... To... Eat, you know, like, do things. I suppose, like, customize the area. Like, I, I love the location of my home. Because you see on the map, it's... It's very close to... The store. And it's not super far off from... Back here. Urgh! And it's it, and it's not that far from the town hall either. It's essentially in between, really. But, uh, after I get that bridge fully paid off... Oh! Well... Who's confirmed cruise on day two? Nice! I, I'm guessing you had to kill a man for it. <laughs> Whether it be friendly or, or meanie. Honestly, I kind of miss... The mafia, the I'm kind of sad that they took it out. No poisoner, nice. One less thing the doc has to deal with. <laughs> what was I talking about? I forget. <laughs> I, I I know I said it was about location. Oh yeah. Once I get the... Nice. So that's like two down, right? Selfie, what are you doing? Don't you be sniffing over there. I don't want you stealing my stuff. You already stole enough of my toiletries. You old jerk. I'm gonna have to get... Uh, a small tote with latches. Just to <laughs> make sure she doesn't... Get into my stuff anymore. But, uh. Yeah, once I 
get that bridge done, I'll be able to build a ramp to make it easier to access up here. And I won't le need ladders as much. Necker and Dusa were hung. Sounds like sounds like t town wipes the floor with coven. <laughs> Build here. I would like to imagine it first, just to make sure I am happy with this location. Found one. Yeah, I figured as much. <laughs> hmm. I mean, it doesn't look too bad there. You can always do landscaping. Barwolf was last evil. Hmm. What do you think, guys? I, mean, I think it's a pretty okay location. Sophie. Hi. So perfect. I start a new location, same island though. <laughs> Oof, even in a in a, a casual game it feels like a huge thing to move. Cool oh, moth. Werewolf SKU. Damn. Everyone? Wait a second. I think the prerequisite for like, or the requisite for all of them is no town members remaining, right? Because neutrals just need to fulfill the win condition, which is usually uh, town gone. Moth to win town gone. There are only five town. <laughs> I imagine there's a bloodbath amongst the evils too because well if there's if it's basically an evil heavy town some evils are going to get ca caught in the crossfire one way or another. Sophie get it! No! Sophie! Don't go under my bed. You're not allowed under there. One thing you when you do it under my mom's bed, but you're you're not allowed under mine. Stop wagging your tail. No. I'm not happy about it. No. Ugh. <laughs> A first game. Really? You just unplugged my headset, you little jerk? Uh, Burr's game. Wait, what is that shorthand for? Oh, Berserker. Oh, that explains it. It's a Coven 2 stuff. Or, TOS 2. Sorry. Blech. Wait, that's like two out of four of Horsemen of the Apocalypse, right? If I'm not mistaken. I think. Because I know Soul Collector goes into death, I think. Uh. What, the Baker goes into Famine? 
Plague bearer goes to pestilence. I, I think berserker would go into war, right? I don't know. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So I do have it correct. Mm-hmm. Are they counted by uh, counted as neutrals? Because I think they all share the same wind condition. Hello there, Alex. Welcome in. It's good to see you too, Paws. We're chilling with some Animal Crossing today. Just gonna do whatever. <laughs> today is a good day. You're excited. What? 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 what were you excited for? Also, uh. Oh yeah, I should just suit myself properly. Malarashi. No. No, I didn't. And I have no idea if you're trolling me or not. I don't really know much about cars. Tomorrow is your birthday. <gasps> Happy birthday. The car brand Jeep? Yeah, I've seen one on the road. Congratulations, Paws. All the February birthdays are happening. <laughs> I mean, it's February, so... Makes sense. What, from Hunter x Hunter or Gohan from Dragon Ball? since I've watched any. I, I would like to watch Fear Run. It seems good. There's another one that I... that caught my attention to, but I forgot. Uh. I hear a balloon. Where is balloon? that balloon and it's bugging me so much <laughs> aha there you are you fool nobody knew you're a berserker because you failed your night two kill you hit an immune what's the immune you hit though and what type of attack does berserker have is it basic or powerful because if it's basic, I can see why it'd fail. You hit a jailed. Ah, I see. The jailed claimed they were attacked. <gasps> Niv! I found an unfinished puzzle! Ooh, it's kind of pretty. Yeah, I should use it to bug him. <laughs> Uh, for those who, do, who are new here, Niv's one of my mo- Oh, hi. He's here. <laughs> so many snowflakes here. Snowflakes! Yes, I know you like puzzles. Ah, oh, no, my knit! Uh, how dare I, I- I think you're, you're not here? I don't know. You're, you're just being extra quiet. <laughs> but here's the unfinished puzzle I was talking about. I just got it from a balloon. From a balloon present. This is what it looks like. Like a sunset beachy unfinished puzzle. You're playing a board game in the background. Oh really? What kind? Catan? I wouldn't be surprised. Sip, sip, sip 5. No, Sip 5. 
Because I remember you've been playing that non-stop these past couple of days. You do like your sieve. I will say that. I love how I used my step-up ladder. Step-up ladder. Uh, I love how I used my ladder instead of this, which was like right next to that cliff slide. <sighs> I need to get a new... Uh, net from storage. Oh, you almost tortured a whole class of kids. Do tell. I am interested. <laughs> I want to know how you scarred them for life. What'd you do? Tell them cursed facts about life? With a single mouse. Ah, I see. You went for simplicity. I'm trying to think, like, what you could have done that would have scarred their their lives with a mouse. But, like, uh... Oh, you grabbed a, an actual legit mouse from outdoors? <laughs> and you just let it run around? <laughs> oh, please tell me you're the teacher. <laughs> That is so hilarious. How many frozen fences do I have in storage again? I need to make 30 more and then I'll be happy. You're a student. Oh! <laughs> Did you get in trouble? Did you get in trouble? <laughs> it was beautiful. I wonder how many screams you earned. Yes, but it was worth it. <laughs> I mean, it sounds like it was worth it if you got that much of a reaction out of everybody. <laughs> oh, everyone. Sheesh, I don't think everyone's gonna forget that day now. <laughs> You should have screamed with them so 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 they couldn't tell it was you who brought it in. <laughs> that way you would have partially covered your tracks. It's like it's like who did it? I don't know, teacher. Mouse just got in the building. <laughs> no? Aw. <Aww. laughs> you they saw you walk in with it, my dude. You could, you, you could have, uh, you could have really fooled them if you, um, if you just, like, had it in your pocket or whatever, and then it, you just, like, discreetly let it slip out mid-class. You're like, oh, look, there's a mouse! Am I winning? I mean, I, compl I, fi I, f I received and finished my, off my loan in the same day for an expansion to my... My house <laughs> in Animal Crossing. I I had a sugar mom come over and give me a whole bunch of bells. I move. I'm moving my house to uh, the top of the hill so I can have more space to put stuff. And Milo here was sharing a story about how they caught a mouse from outside with their bare hands and just let it run, run around the classroom. <laughs> and now everyone screamed their butts off. Got in trouble for it, but it was worth it, apparently. <laughs> Cat move there. Chad move. It's beautiful. To be honest, if I saw that, if it happened in my classroom, if we were classmates, I would laugh my butt off too. Yeah, the sugar tarnished. What? Oh! They just invaded you, gave you a bunch of stuff, and then just left? <laughs> oh, that's funny. That reminds me of a time that, uh... 
that uh, so this weird green skin goblin looking dude invaded my world, threw stuff at me, hid, and was just overall being an absolute goblin. It was funny. But right before, like, while they're leaving, <laughs> I think I killed them. <laughs> they knew the mouse existed before you even brought it in? My dude. They are not sharp at all. <laughs> it was in a different classroom. Oh. So, they put it outside, you grabbed it, and then you brought it back inside. Am I correct in surmising that? <laughs> Return of the mousening. My voice actually is starting to feel a little bit tired. Huh. I think it's because I, I'm not used to talking for this long after, like, so many months of not streaming. Good job, Milo. Good job. Oh <laughs> uh, yeah, Mr. Karai! Did you... F uh, did you... catch up yet? I usually faint after nine minutes. Wait, who, who's she? Me? I mean, I'm the only girl I know in this room. And uh, no, I do not faint after 90 minutes. My voice is just getting tired. My throat. That's the only entertainment? <laughs> Well, at least now that other people have stories to tell, right? It's like, oh yeah, my idiot class re brought a mouse in and scared everybody to death, including me. <laughs> I th that has to go into the, into the yearbook, seriously. If not, shame on them. And what makes it worse? <laughs> Hey, if anything, you woke everybody up. They were smiling the entire time like some freak. <laughs> word for word? My dude. <laughs> word for word. Oh, that's funny. <coughs> Should drink some water. You're trying not to laugh, dude. If I if that was me, I'd be I would I would have been dying of laughter. Or 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 I would be tr trying to stop myself from laughing. <laughs> <sighs> Reminds me of a time that a, a, a stink bug got in uh, my parents' car. On the way back home. My sister and I found it. I think it was on her side first. She started screaming. I started laughing. And then, the bed, the bed bug, no, 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 no. The stink bug decided to come back my way, and then it was my turn to scream. And then she started laughing, and it just went back and forth until my, until our dad told us to shut up. But <laughs> my mom would stop laughing. And that was basically like the whole way back for like five minutes until we finally managed to get out of the car on the driveway. <laughs> 
<laughs> we got rid of the stupid stink bug that was terrorizing us. It was like it was like simultaneous the most hilarious thing and also the most torturous thing we had to deal with in a car. Seriously, some kid in a hoodie? Yeah, to be Kimmy, they don't even know your name. <sighs> you would have been a school legend if they said your name. Yeah, people walk up to you like, why'd you do that? Are you kidding me? It's hilarious. Ah, it's okay. You can you can tell the story to other people. They'll they'll figure out real fast who did it. I mean, that is if you want to share the story, that is. Which it sounds like you do, because you're telling me and everyone else here. Uh, what else am I gonna do? Uh, sell this stuff, maybe? You, you trolled a kid by telling the exact story? <laughs> oh, really? You changed up some of the words. Ah, I see, paraphrased. <laughs> Shiny. Haha. <laughs> Yo, I heard this friend getting up and he let him mouth loose. <laughs> 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 Took him five seconds. <laughs> Good job. I love my community. The sweetest people you'll meet who are also trolls. <laughs> I'm feeling something fresh and it's driving me nuts. <laughs> also, my nose is a little stuffy. <laughs> I wonder how much a frozen fence so sells for. I'll figure it out. I managed to craft up 100 frozen fences. And I do not regret a thing. Oh, you almost had an anxiety attack. Oh, you, you can't handle loud noises. It doesn't mostly apply to like sudden ones or like any loud noise. Because honestly, like either way, that sucks. Why in the world with a bunch of cabinet though? Sudden ones, yeah, I get you. I mean, you can't always expect the unexpected, so. Of course it. It, I get you there. But why would they punch a cabinet? Like, completely unnecessary. Oh, were they angry at it or something? Or. Oh, uh, of course. A joke that ticked them off. A kettlebell. Sure. Don't worry, I have plenty of iron nuggets. So, <laughs> I had just crafted that into something so I could just sell it. I gotta make that moolah. You, come here. You're being sold on the black market. I can't even take what I say seriously. You're being so sold to raccoon black market. A bowling shirt. It actually kind of looks nice. And it actually reminds me of uh, my bowling days. 
Because I, I was uh, in a youth bowling league at some point. All the way up until I was like roughly 18 and had to go to college. I mean, once I get like a more stable income, I, I think I'll, I'll go back to bowling. But, oh, I'm gonna be so rusty. It's been a few years. Aww. You, you made... You made your two favorite people things and they just like ditched you? That's sad. Not even a thank you? Seriously, I just moved to the other side of this thing. Come back here. Let me have you. Yes! Mine. They only start dating because you introduce them to each other. <laughs> that doesn't sound like they're very good friends if they just like ditch you like a lot. But I, I mean, I don't know them personally like you do, so I I'm only giving you my outsider perspective. Try to give them. You try to give them something, they ditch you. They only start dating because you introduce them to each other. <laughs> School of life, man. Craft. I only came in here to shove stuff into my, uh... Yeah, it is what it is. I mean, what can you do? There are normally good people. Well, if anything, you can always have a talk with them later and see what's going on. Try not to take it to heart too much. Uh, you know, I'd like to see Black Roses. I think the black uh, colored plants, uh, the flowers, are a bit rarer. I don't know how much rarer, though. Hey, Nano, you still there, perchance? That's something I ask of you. I should water these things while I'm at it. Can I water some weeds? No. I. Forget the, forget the, forget the box. We must water the weeds. Let them propagate. Take over the whole island. Whole island. Ah! <laughs> oh, who am I kidding? I'm not gonna let it take over the whole island. <laughs> this being some doofus on the internet. I thought of a funny D and D character. Seriously, auto mod. How in the world is that? Oh, come on. There are worse things than that word. Come on. And a sec doesn't have to apply someone down there. It doesn't have to. It can apply to a bag. Or or it could be like a... Like a... Like a just like, you know, a saying in some other language or culture. Yes, Sack triggered the Automod. I... <laughs> it can be even used in, like, football terms. Like, oh, the quarterback got sacked, you know? It, it's... that's just so silly. <laughs> Sorry, there's... <laughs> Cyan.
Anyways, you you have a you have a good good sleep. Yeah, you have a good sleep. Do what you gotta do. Take care of yourself. Thank you for being here. Nice chilling with you. <laughs> oh, what a way to get out. Oh, yeah, I don't think I watered the flowers, did I? Cat girl has these cut into the D and D world, so. So, um, I'm guessing maybe like a tabaxi? Is that what you're going with? Because I think that's like the. That's basically like cat folk. Ooh. No! My watering can! Oh, seven for the watering can. No. <laughs> okay, now time to sell my stuff. And you can go ahead and uh, tell the rest of your story. The back says this kite kind of sounds funny. Not the truck, Coon! Or I don't know, maybe, maybe uh, some goddess decided to go yoink. Oh wait, you're needed over here. Sorry. You gotta fulfill my mission now. It's okay, I'll give you some random cool powers or nothing at all because I don't care about you that much, but I need you to do my stuff anyways. I don't know, there's like a whole bunch of these sky tropes. <laughs> He's a sorcerer, I see. Her god has married her. What? Okay, that cat girl's winning in life. <laughs> I'm guessing that goddess needed help with needed help with something. Okay. Sophie, am I going crazy? Oh. You're right under my desk. <laughs> I'm not going crazy. Okay, I'll give you some pets. Hey! What are you throwing snowballs at? How dare you, dribbling? Hi. <laughs> Your luck is basically na 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 na. Hmm. That could go either way. It could be like the world's worst luck or the world's best luck. <laughs> Let's just save a lot of ammo. What'd you do? Throw snowballs at the poor kids on the street? Honestly, I'd be laughing at that too. <laughs> I'm so paranoid that she's gonna try getting under my bed. Yeah, married a goddess to say good luck. Could always be the opposite of that and could be like, I don't know, like a trickster goddess. Like when the crits happen, they're really good. Like really, really good. But when the nat one hits, it's really, really bad. Could be like that. I'm just pitching ideas, like things you could do with the character. And you can always like work it out with a DM. So that, you know, when they describe those scenarios when you do crit, or you do get the nat one. Uh, you, you can always help the- have the DM help you flavor. A and, uh, describe what happens. The reference to Mouse Snow shown in media on Discord. What? In Discord? What? What did you do? Oh, that is a lot of snow! 
<gasps> Dude, you can't even get out of there. You're, the, the cars are like buried like halfway, like... They're, like, they're buried so much to the point, like, it's like up to like top of the wheel. Dude, that is so much snow. I applaud you for managing to get your walkway completely cleared, though. Midway up the windows on the car, actually. What? So... What I'm looking at here... Is just scratching the surface. My dude, I feel so bad for you. Just 10 minutes ago. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. What's... What state you live in, man? It's gotta be like something like Minnesota. Because I, I know they get a lot of snow up there. Scary camera footage from your house. Yeah, I figured because I saw that corner. Three to four feet of snow. Plow roll is about six feet. Province Nova Scotia. Oh, I see. Up there. It's hard to keep track of who's where. <laughs> no, please, no, not the harem, no! No, Milo, don't do it! Don't do it! It's not worth it! I think the goddess would kill your tabaxi over that. That leftover wind from Florida. Leftover snow from the Midwest. That sounds fun. Honestly, I mean... It's been relatively cool here, but we haven't had anything like several feet of snow. You said it was the tabaxi fault? What? Are you talking like some rival deity of the goddess decided to like try and mess with her, uh, with the goddess's love life or something? <laughs> and the tabaxi just got caught up in the middle of it? <laughs> Cause that would be hilarious plot point. Oh, that is 100 150 miles per hour winds? Dude, that would blow you over. I can only imagine how long you've had you've been stuck inside. Yes, exactly that. <laughs> There's only one in Blue Archive whose looks that can be most accurately described as yes. <laughs> Go on, lay it on us. Softwood. I needed softwood for an old-fashioned wash tub. Yeah, that's right. I need to do that. Softwood. I don't really know much of any blue archive. I mean, I know some characters with good luck stats in games, but, uh... I don't know any blue archive. <laughs> in games or in enemies. This is the bathroom I gotta work on, and you guys didn't get to see it. Uh, soft wood. Move the pockets. Oh, you're talking about Sword Art Online. From the Maid Club, cleaning and clearing as a luck stat of yes. Does it apply specifically to cleaning and clearing? I love the idea who just saw it and, and just went, the tabaxi is hot, oh no. Applies to everything she does. You gotta be kidding me. Her crits must be massive too. You know, the cr Like, getting a critical hit. I'd be terrified of that. 
Imagine rolling a nat 20 every single time and having that damage doubled. Like, every single time. In multi-hits and stuff. No, thank you. <laughs> okay, time to make that wash tub. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do that. Imagine not having anything that wasn't crickly on your roll table. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? Your character cannot fail saving throws. Lucky feet? Or, or something? Oh, they allowed you that. So, so the minimum you, minimum you get is a two. I mean, that's what I'd assume. The minimum you, you can get is like a two. So you're not critically failing. I mean, you're still failing, but not like you set the whole world on fire type of failing. <laughs> I mean, as long as your DM's cool with it. Let the chaos commence. <laughs> You just cannot fail. Okay. Hmm. Oh yeah, I need to make a flimsy wiring cam. Need softwood. He has no prior organization skills? What? My dude. They should at least, I don't know, like roll a die and see if she actually fails. <laughs> Not like allow her to succeed every time, Treadwing. Two sheets out of a thousand. Actually, that's a pretty good, good track record. Watering can. That's, that's insane. Her luck stat has to be maxed out, dude. Like, incredibly maxed out. Her minimum is 10. Okay. One thing I will say, though, failures can be hilarious. Seriously. <laughs> uh, I can't remember what my most hilarious fail was, though. Alright. <laughs> I mean, like I said, as long as your dance cool with it. This is your DM speaking. Would you like to take the dramatic? Like, I don't know, if you, like, fail a stealth roll at trying to get through a bandit hideout while dressed as a bandit or not dressed as a bandit, be like, uh, guys, I got hoodwinked and, and my, my bandit clothes were stolen and I had to take these off some poor son on the, on, who was dead on the road. Also, I need help finding uh, stuff to replace my other stuff. And, and we're smithing, man. <laughs> The most epic fails can also have the most creative solutions, too. Uh, actually, I think that's why I love TNT so much, is because there's so much you can do with it. The World of Dar Darkness family of games. I can't say I've heard of that, but it sounds interesting. The dramatic failure system to turn critical failures into creative successes. Oh, so you can fail, but if you're creative enough, you can possibly find a way out of it. That's interesting. Yep. 
Any time to put that into storage. He only, has only actually failed a single stealth check. That's nuts. There's one in Pathfinder 2 for the dramatics. Ooh. Eh? What I... <laughs> Let you turn a critical miss into a bank shot. <laughs> What is it on here? Word reward. Uh, why is this encouraging me to hoard? I don't like this. <laughs> they only fail because their deities were asleep. Ha! <laughs> Customize items. Okay. Wait, I think there's one thing in my storage that I can customize. Other... You know, it'd be nice if they made, like, a... Customizable category. I also need to get a customization kit out. We have the pockets. Craft. An entire city by accident? What? My dude! That's a bit extreme for a nat one. Had to be like a dire situation. Gotta be kidding me. Frozen fence. Done. Hmm. Thought I saw something outside. Guess not. At least for now. I would like to make a brick oven for the kitchen once I get another room. That would be nice. I mean, look at it. It looks nice. <laughs> tire stack. I'm gonna need old tires for that. Recycled thumb piano. Oh, my mom's home. Ironwood dresser. Think. How do I customize stuff? Put in storage. Panicked and went kaboom. Oh no. <laughs> yes. Wait, no. No, no, no. I don't want to craft something. I want to customize. Yeah, there we go. Except her. <laughs> it really, that really does sound like it came straight out of Isekai. New customizing. I'm done for now. Okay, now what? Oh, I gotta customize two things. Okay, I'll just get another customization kit out. <laughs> Managed to charm a dark elf by accident. Funnily enough, 
Now that you mentioned Dark Elves, Dark Elves are actually amongst my favorite elves ever. In Final Fantasy XIV Online, I, I, I play as a Dusk White Elizin. <laughs> I'm told that uh, Elizin aren't that common either. Sure, let's go with this. And that's gonna die anyway, so what's the point? What's the point in customizing? I mean, if it's furniture I'm customizing, sure. But, uh... It's something that's gonna easily break, nah. Also, I'm gonna put the air circulator back. <laughs> that's, that's funny, Milo. Most attractive person in the entire D and D world. I wouldn't be surprised if the uh, Tabaxi got a a nickname for it, like I don't know, like the Ethereal Beauty or whatever, or 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 like even like the Ruby of the Sea. <laughs> Yeah, give me that five times, baby. No, we just gotta talk to random people to get double on that one. Oh no, not the paparazzi. Yeah, I can see that Tabaxi uh, taking some levels in Rogue just to be able to get away from people. Huh. <laughs> Maybe pick up proficiency in stealth if you don't have it already. She has? Oh. <laughs> Hi, I gotta talk to you, unfortunately. I put like five points in the stealth, I see. hearing outside my room. I don't know. You know, I had a realization. I'm actually kind of actually quite happy streaming. <laughs> actually kind of miss it. Maybe I'll make it more regular thing. Thing is, I don't want to force it either. But, uh... Is me streaming at this hour actually a little bit more ideal for you guys? I'm, I'm just curious. I know that... I don't know that people are in different time zones and whatnot. Like, you know, I've got people from Brazil who watch me sometimes. People from... UK. Malaysia. You name it. Backseat hits the popularity? Fair enough. I mean, I would hate to get crushed to death by that level of popularity, too. It's like, ugh. No, thank you. <laughs> I mean, don't get me wrong. I'm always striving to, to grow, but, like, 
Why do you think I'm a VTuber? It's so I can have some privacy. <laughs> Funny enough to get confused for a first succubus. That's... <laughs> and then let me get some cleric has to confirm that she's not a succubus. Or a paladin. Actually, it's paladin, I think. Because they, they have that divine sense. That's funny. Like, nope, she's just a very attractive woman that's somehow able to charm you. Happens every time she enters a city. Oh boy. Well, I suppose that's your drawback to the I cannot fail. <laughs> Actually, now that I'm thinking about it, I should go ahead and move these to, I don't know, Poncho's house because his house looks like, I don't know, a garden could naturally be there. <laughs> Let's go ahead and get these uprooted. Temporarily, of course. Ah. Uh, Reminds me, I kind of miss gardening. That's rare. Having deities that intervene. Usually, I mean, for a deity to intervene, that's like... Usually pretty significant. Let's go ahead and finish up the use tomato sprout plants. Oh no! That's awful! How'd you manage to solve it? I mean, all that datingness and stuff going on. Small carrot sprout. Deities. <laughs> Figured. Hey. It sounds like you're just in the middle of some rom-com <laughs> anime. <laughs> Persuasive, or, well, more easily persuaded. Poisoned? I need to get Poncho a more sports, sportsy chair. And poor guy needs an actual bed too. Been sleeping in a sleeping bag this entire time. <laughs> He's like, huh? Was someone there? No, no one was there. You've imagined things. <laughs> I wonder if there's anything in this rock today. No, there isn't. Bad. Almost blew up the city. <laughs> That's a upset they got. Oof. Uh-oh. 
12. Seems like a dog did poop in the house after all. Oh, I got stuff. <gasps> Ooh, what did I get from Puck? I wonder. No, I don't want to keep on the third way. Yours in soreness. <laughs> box is so creaky. <laughs> A beach ball. And simple knit sweater. What does that look like? Eh, it's not bad. It's something I'd wear. I think I'll sell the rest of the stuff. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways. <laughs> eh, doing okay. I have to deal with the fact that my, uh... Oh, one of the panes to my top window is broken. And the the glass place had a sudden emergency, even though my pep up like arrived there. Despite, you know, like I mean, he called far in advance to make sure that they'd be open, but they weren't by the time he got there. And well, I'm just gonna have to wait till tomorrow. Also, a bit of my, uh, mosquito nets also. My, my, part of my mosquito nets got a hole in it, so. I'm hoping that gets replaced too, because... Come summertime, y you want to keep the bugs out while keeping your house cool. Eh, we can get rid of the cedar tree. Completely unnecessary in my inventory. Mm. That's a huge fish. Never tell your tabaxi's a nickname. What'd you go with? Yes, I got it. A tire? Yeah, I am tired of that. <laughs> Hmm. 
Mmm, I smell the f fresh fabric. I like that smell. A bitterling. Yeah, me, but only a little. Moonlight lady. I see. Really? No, let me talk to her. Uh, did you know that there's like a there's a Japanese phrase that translates to uh, I think the moon is the moon is beautiful, isn't it? And that's their way say uh, of saying I love you, I believe. <laughs> I I can't remember what the exact words are, but I do remember that. I should get these flowers. Sell them. Ah? <laughs> Discovered something new today, huh? So honestly, that perfect that worked out perfectly <laughs> for you. <sighs> Being a little tired. <laughs> that is actually kind of funny. Never goes at night because of can't can't put up with the nightlife. seen him in chat or not but nano nano cloud was in chat earlier said hi see what's up uh he's a dm and uh once we get like scheduling figured out between the three players plus plus him we're, we're gonna be doing a kingdom hearts uh it's gonna be a one shot unless uh, unless um nano is able to figure out how to weave our Backstories together a little bit more easily. I mean, we don't necessarily have bad backstories. It's just sometimes you hit like a creative roadblock, you know, and you're not sure how to resolve things. <laughs> Honestly, it's good to be wary about nighttime anyways because so many different things can happen especially like in in D, D in general like which tends to be like more of like a medieval setting uh, like back uh, s stabbings can happen kidnappings can happen you name it <laughs> things that you know might not occur as Commonly in this day and age. Oh no, an entire city. <laughs> well, hey, I mean, she can always learn makeup to make her look more normal. I'm not sure it'd work effectively on fur, though, but I bet there's like fur oriented makeup. You'd be surprised at how much, like, a little bit of makeup can do. Just try, I don't know. <laughs> that doesn't sound too good. <laughs> yeah, it sounds like it failed. Miserably. Oh no. I wonder how Cabbage White is out and about in the middle of February. I have not seen a single one. 
IRL. <laughs> Aha! Oh, it's just a tiger beetle. I don't want to uproot everything just to find a stupid mole cricket. Uh, sounds close, though. Aha! Found you. Take that, you jerk. Okay. No, 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 no. Go to water and can. Did she try a mask? <laughs> Maybe like the ugliest mask you've ever seen. It hasn't yet? Hey. Well, there you go. You got an idea. And if you got access to disguise self, you can like temporarily uh, make yourself look normal. <laughs> And uh, all you gotta do is like duck into an alleyway and just reapply as needed. Spot a snowflake over there. I mind if I do. These are some of my favorite things to find. <laughs> oh, I have enough for a wreath. for today I've planted an entire thing a party hates it why, why would they hate it uh, I got my site moved well for now it, it's in the process I got a new room as well. Uh, I think. I think. Are you another balloon? I do. The reason why I'm not crafting that wallpaper is because I I need the stone in case one of my tools breaks and and, uh, and the shop's not open. Another stupid mole cricket. Should be around here somewhere. Sounds like I'm right on top of it. Okay, it's not any of these spaces. Where are you, you stupid thing? Annoying the living daylights on me. Aha! Found you! 
Get here. Ha! Drop. Snowflake wreath. Marshall just killed two townies. Oh no. Wait, is that the new? Is that the new one? Oh no. Two townies, you plus the jink. Wait, so they killed four? Am I correct? Four people. No? Oh, 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 oh wait. Uh, you as in you with the jinx. Okay. <laughs> That's unlucky. There's always next time. Come here. I like catching these things, they're pretty. Also, free money. <laughs> Modded, uh, Tano Salem 1? No, but I've, I've watched somebody who, who's done Modded Ta Town of Salem before. So I know a little. I, I've played, like, customless before. But that's, like, the extent I've ever done. Roll of votes three people up and kills them? That's new. I mean, I... I mean, I know about the prosecutor. So it's basically the prosecutor, but on steroids. <laughs> I'd hate for that to happen to me. Yeah, Bikini, where is this stupid thing? Hold on. What do you mean, hold on? What? I'm confused. Oh, come on. Actually, get the cricket! Thank you. I don't know how many can I get. What? Double pros. I miss some ammo. Pros. We can do their ability twice now. For that strong of an ability, they should not be able to do that twice. Not unless you reduce the number of people that can be prosecuted at a given time. I mean, look at prosecutor. One and done. And they die if they, <laughs> they kill a tiny, tiny. One at a time, two per day. No, 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 no.
if their ability guaranteed kills wherever they click the button on, they sh they should uh they should adjust that. One at a time, two per day. <laughs> it's a new thing? Wait, like legit new thing? It used to be one. Huh. Elephant watering can? Oh, you've got to be kidding me. It's actually kind of cute. I'll, I'll get one. Marshall, prosecutor, and de deputy. Oh, that sounds like an absolute bloodbath. Seriously, that's like three TK. All with like immense killing power to a degree. <laughs> yeah, actually, I think that's like three daytime TKs. If I'm not mistaken. Two town, uh, two TK. TTP as well. Oh wait, town, town power. I, I'm so used to TP being town protect. Cause that, that that's, I, I used to play TOS 1. For a time. And uh, that's, that's what I knew it as. Yeah, I appreciate you putting the owl after it. <laughs> Makes it less confusing. Wait, no, 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 I don't want to stop, stop. I keep pressing buttons too fast. Place item. Two townies and jinx. Honestly, was that worth it, Marshall? Was that worth it? I mean, you got the jinx out, but at the cost of two, t two town. So you're, you're still losing out. It's like as if you like mislynched, you know. Uh, at least the prosecutor. At least the prosecutor did their job correctly. <laughs> but yeah, it's like two townies for just one jinx. Nah, not worth it in my opinion. Hey Niv, are you still there? Niv. Nivario. Maybe I'll summon him by calling him. It was earlier. Originally doing 369. Oh, so it's just luck of the draw. Oh, you really did get unlucky. What was six? A townie? <laughs> Which means had they not misclicked, 
They would have really done screwed up. Honestly, that might have changed the game had that actually happened. I don't know how much it would change the game. Oh. Six was prosecutor? Well, that explains it. I would have laughed if they, uh... They just killed the prosecutor anyways. <laughs> you fool! I'm listening to a story right now that's happening in the other room. <laughs> Oh boy, <laughs> they're actually quite wild. Another Marshall game? <laughs> Wait, what's MON? Poisoner, Executioner, and... Monarch. Ah, Monarch. Gotcha. Did they change town support to town power? Because I'll be honest with you. If it were like TOS 1 terms, giving people the ability to vote would be classified under town support. more confusing in the next town of Salem. No! Always have a net on you at all times, people. At least it wasn't too town. Oh, hey. Dude, I would hate to be like one of two townies in a, in a, basically an all evil game. Although I will admit, like basically an like an all evil game, it definitely shakes things up. And instead of like a townie trying to claim to be a townie, I mean, I I mean it has the potential to be shaken up. Did you also poison in your ex? Mark stone and PM. Oh no. <laughs> Actually, Potion Master is my favorite coven role. Happy lurking, Winter. Thanks for being here. Do what you gotta do. What a wild graveyard. I'd be scared. <laughs> Thought you dodged one bullet with the arsonist? Nah. There's something else out there too. 
Although I, I'd say arsonist is probably like the biggest bullet dodged. Because, you know, aside from like Hexmaster and a, some other roles, uh, they're they're one of one of the few that can multi kill in a single night. <laughs> Funny how a lot of the neutral roles have the multi kill ability. <laughs> Probably just shake things up. I do schoolwork, waiting for a while for people to deliver stuff, but it didn't happen, so time for work. Uh, I see. That's fun. People not doing what they're supposed to do. Can't really help it. You can scold them later. I gotta put this wasp, wasp nest away. Thankfully, because of my general rule of thumb of always have a net out when you're shaking a tree, I haven't really suffered too many stings. I'm very adamant about not getting stung. It, it just sucks. It hurts like the first time, but I think after every time he gets, like every time he gets stung after that, you just like black out. I think. Uh, is there anything else in the trees? Oh, a bagworm. Hmm. <laughs> Where is that mole cricket? No, I did not want to dig there again. that stupid thing. Come on! This chicken's probably gonna think I'm crazy for whatever reason. Like, why is this person digging so many holes? Trying to find a stupid cricket. About time. Ah! Come on. This is why you don't dig too many holes, guys. Okay, we'll just hide again. Now I gotta wait for it to rear its head again. Longhorned beetle. Aren't you happy for me? No, a lamp. I wonder if 
it looks the way I think it would. No, it doesn't. It looks genuinely different. I thought it was going to be like one of those traditional old-fashioned ones. I know, I got surprised. out of all my gear I go through nets the most because I just I just go trying to catch stuff so much whether it be a snowflake whether it be from a wasp or it's just I tend to go bug hunting a lot I guess <laughs> I mean hey good source of income I ain't gonna complain Hmm. I'm thinking of looking into a raid soon. I'm quite content with streaming as much as I did. Or how? I don't know. BRB, okay. Don't fall in the toilet. <laughs> thousand bells or all of that it's not bad i suppose oh so clumps of weeds <laughs> i chopped down trees no good morning oh gotta catch a wharf roach why do i always get that whenever like i always get it af like before I find a, f we know after I find a. F I I just never get it whenever there's a wharf ridge around. What I'm trying to say. Wait, why am I looking at this stuff again? I guess it's from habit. <laughs> Wait, what am I doing? Ah, uh, I think I was gonna get more cherries. Because, um... It takes a couple days for the fruit to grow back. I'll take five. Ouch, that hurts me on the inside. I just need them for when I need to break rocks or move a tree. That's mainly why I keep them in my inventory. And, it did, and, and I always keep 30 tree branches on me. In case if, let's just say I'm on a deserted island and one of my tools breaks, I can make a, a flimsy emergency one in case. And I always keep medicine on me too in case for whatever reason a wasp gets the better of me. It's just, I think those three items are essential. Also, keeping a little stone with you, too. Like, those four items, it's... is crucial. Outside of your just, your, your regular tools. And they never leave my inventory because I'm always using them. Hello, welcome back. Did the sea bears get you or almost get you? Well, if, I'd say I suppose if they got you, you wouldn't be here now, would you? <laughs> I had to take out the trash. Fair enough. I'm guessing. Uh, right now. No, you just need to get the tree. Throw another 
throw in the trash bin until until trash day comes, I suppose. is pretty fruitful day on Animal Crossing. Oh no, I was planning on re reading out. Hi guys. Hi <laughs> Riso. Milo, meet Riso, another epic person who's around in the community and stuff. And don't worry, okay. <laughs> we follow. Well, since you're here, I mean, you're happy to give some read suggestions, too. I was planning on winding, winding down soon, because my throat feels a little tired. And honestly, I haven't sh streamed in, like, a good amount of weeks. But I'd say feel free to give Riesel some support. He is an adorable bean. A sassy man. Funny. <laughs> But thank you guys, I appreciate it. We're, we were just uh, chilling on Animal Crossing for today. Because I felt today's a good day. Felt like streaming. And I just wanted to uh, stream a cozy game, I guess. <laughs> I've been in the mood for like creating stuff. And I would do. I would have done maybe Minecraft, but uh. Eh, I, I, t I just felt Animal Crossing. <laughs> you're rocking, you're working on a discussion post about The Walking Dead. <laughs> I wonder how much I can sell ski slope flooring for. I'm all done for now. Uh, my room's not amazing, but this- it is what it is. It, it takes time to put together the vision. But I did recently get a new room established. I think I've seen season one four times. Yeah, you, you do uh, watch a bunch of that. And Stranger Things. But behold! The unceremonious bathroom that's not yet complete. I did order some stuff. I do plan on including it, but uh, <laughs> it'll, it'll get better with time. I should take that off the wall. Like, I, I know I was joking about it, like, oh, it'll stare you in the face while, while watching you pee, but <laughs> I, I said make that joke earlier, but I'm like, um, I wouldn't actually want that in my bathroom, though. I'll just put it in storage for now. Maybe, like, where on, like, I don't know. Like a special occasion. You rewatch how one of your games went heat. It's always nice being able to look back on games you've made, you've played in the past, so you can learn from them. I think it's good for anybody, really. Whether you're a pro or casual, or you just want to get better. Game replay mod for TOS 2. Interesting. I want to see how much this is. How much is it? 3,200 bells. Dude, that's like more than any wreath. Because a uh, snow wreath, uh, you get... I think 1600 bells from this. The ski slope flooring you get 3200. I, I I play a lot of Animal Crossing as you can tell. I just like to know how much I can get uh, how much bang I can get for my buck. Or you know, just 
being able to like sell things and get a lot out of it. Oh, you should have seen Senpai earlier. She just like, as soon as she found out that I was playing Animal Crossing, she's like, what's your friend code? I want to know what it is. I want to come visit. And you know what she does when she, she visits my island? Gives me like millions of bells. I legit have an Animal Crossing sugar mom. <laughs> it was nuts. And she also gave me all these vegetables too. So I could plant them. Like wheat, tomatoes, different colors of pumpkin. Even a recipe, which I already had the recipe too. <laughs> Senpai be the Animal Crossing sugar mama. <laughs> For real, hey, I, hey, Jax, how are you doing? Oh, that is a cute emote. I don't know who that is. Uh, but hello. The silent berserk game. How am I? Today's a good day, so small victory. Also, I had really good sleep last night and the night before, so I'm even happier about that. Like, I feel like I actually have some energy. Now, I would have, um, I would have been up later last night to play games with you guys in Robbie's community night, but, uh, <laughs> I'm like, uh, I had the itch to go to bed. So I did. Best decision of my life. <laughs> uh, what are you doing? Oh. No one redeems that so much, so I, I have to remind myself what it does. <laughs> Hashtag exposed. What does it do? Oh, you want me to insult you? My dude, why? You're an idiot for doing that. <laughs> I, I I don't know if I have the heart to insult somebody that I'm just starting to get to know. Yeah, that's what it does. <laughs> you willingly sign yourself up for an insult. You didn't read it, my dude. <laughs> <coughs> okay, I'll I'll read you I'll read you it this time, but after that you're you're on your own. Dude, why do you do this to yourself? Well since you asked for it. I'll verbally insult you, I guess. Milo words always. <laughs> <laughs> well, there's your insult. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. You can. <laughs> if you redeem that, you're willingly signing yourself up for like a, a mini insult or a roast. Well, there's a dog named Cat, right? I don't know. Why <laughs> are you confusing me? You've never seen it. Uh... Dude, I don't know. And hey, 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 Milo, are, are you sure you want the insult? Or if not, I can have one of the mods refund it. It's up to you. Also, I do feel like a little unwilling to insult someone. You'd like it refunded? Okay. Winter, would you be so kind? Uh, what? Oh no! Never mind. <laughs> Why do you want insulted? You weirdo. Baka. Salak. Shut up, dogs! You see, you're that stinky. Even the dogs are barking at you. <laughs> I'm gonna have to get better at insulting. Well, if I if I knew you better, I'd be able to. <laughs> ah. 
<laughs> Dogs normally bark at you, I'm not surprised. <laughs> They, they they smell a stinky person. Smelly, stinky, bad person. <laughs> Listen, I don't have it hard to insult right now, so that that's the best you're gonna get. <laughs> oh, you're trying to help me. Okay, I'll, I'll read it out loud for you, Winter. Are you Milo the cat? Because you really need an excuse to be catty and lazy. Really? Yes, actually. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he fit right in here. You he fit in, Milo. <laughs> oh, what am I gonna do with you? Some people are insulted to be called lazy, I guess. Some people simply accept it as a truth about themselves. They're like, yeah, I kinda am. Yeah, me there. Oh well. <laughs> you wanna sleep, Winter? Well, too bad. Oh, Winter, why did you... Why? You're willing to take five naps a day, my dude. I get taking a midday siesta, but like five a day? There's a lot of you're not falling behind on work. Schoolwork and all that. How in the world do you manage to do that while fully awake? You lucked out, Winter. I'm gonna have to get some more nuts. I mean, I could buy several. Or I could make them, but I'm, I'm very protective over the iron ore I have. Eh, whatever, I'll just make them. I gotta be frugal with the bells. How did you manage to get a B in the class when you slept through it all? I never understand some people. I mean, I could see you getting away with that if, if um, the history lessons were on, like, ancient folklore or whatever. I, I'll be honest with you, I never really fall asleep in class. If I did, it was only, like, once or twice. Ever. <laughs> You knew the history of Civil War and Industrial Revolution. Uh, okay. All of the beginning of the US, etc. Yeah, I get you. Honestly, if I'm gonna learn some US history, I'd rather it be about stuff that I, I wouldn't typically know. Because that, that's the, that's all they ever cover is like the bland stuff. Give me the more interesting things, like obscure feuds or whatever, or who actually invented what. Or proud or cool U.S. history facts that we should know but we don't know because they aren't being taught. You had a 14-year-old try hitting on you in a server? Dude. I 
tell him to stay off the internet, man. They should not be doing that at 14 years old. Yeah, <laughs> he had some sass. Tell out the jail bait to go away. <laughs> Asking for things side. What? You're making me more concerned now because I don't know what that means and I I I, I really hope it's not what I think it is. Cause uh <laughs> Oh, asking for pictures. Okay. I would tell him you should not be on the internet. Get off the internet. Dude, that's like a predator in the making right there. Woo okay. Milo, if you're if you're scared to be assertive, just straight up block him, okay? Re block him, report him, move on. Because they should not be doing that stuff on the internet at like 14 years old, let alone be doing that at all. That's just wrong. Seriously. Yeah, you don't have to speak to him. Alright, I made some spare nuts. No, 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 you're not sounding mean at all out to winter. At least not to me. I mean, in situations like that, you gotta know what to do. And, and... Yeah. Yeah, you're not winter. You don't have to worry too much. Sometimes we all need a little bit of advice or a push to... To do the right thing. Especially when we're scared. Because uh, nobody should be having to deal with that kind of stuff. Yeah, sometimes sometimes it can come off a, a little bit annoying or aggressive in text form, but I would say at least in this context, you're fine. Okay, it's just a tree branch. Okay, uh, I'd say if we're gonna introduce someone to the town of Salem, just warn them of what they're getting themselves into. Because I'll admit, even that community is not the greatest. Terms of service, yeah. Uh, <laughs> actually, you should introduce them to terms of service. So you should introduce him to toe. <laughs> uh. What? What, Winter? You're, you're my brain today. No, I was just reading what you said. No, you're not necessarily doing the thinking for me. I'm doing the thinking for you. It was just a shared brain cell moment. <laughs> Now come back! Now! <gasps> A second chance! There we go. <laughs> I should put this iron away while I'm at it. Oh yeah, I should... Um... I was reading Milo's correction and then I saw yours in all caps and I'm like, oh, terms of service. I knew where you were going with it.
You are not my brain. It was a shared brain cell moment. And that is it. Meh. I'd be scared to have you as my brain. Although I think it'd be easier to sass people. You share a brain with someone regularly, weirdly enough? <laughs> it do happen. They are willing to try... What? Try what? Yeah, just block, dude. Block, 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 block. Get away from that. Okay, okay. <laughs> Had us in the first half! My dude. <laughs> You're killing us. <laughs> you hate it here. <laughs> Congratulations, you made one of the mods quit. Funny. No, don't go away. <laughs> Is that good or bad? Uh, Winter just hates you for trolling her. <laughs> She's like, I hate it here. <laughs> it's it's not a bad thing. You insult, you idiot. No, it I'm sorry. <laughs> Wait, Winter, was that my terrible attempt at an insult? <laughs> No, Winter, I'm sorry. No. Go you, Winter. Hi, Winter. Yep, back. Stop wiggling! <laughs> I got it. Nevario? Winter, you usually do that. You jerks. <laughs> Yeah, I figured it was you. You're the only one who ever pulls that off! I'm just taking a picture so I can, uh... Get my Nook Miles. Wait, no, no, no. I don't want to go back in picture mode. Free 100 miles for just taking two seconds to take a random picture. <laughs> Sell a hot item for a fortune. Drop wood. Die for sea creatures. Caf uh, catch a wharf roach. Because fun, haha. -ha. You're so funny. Yeah, good luck uh, with. With, uh, another soundboard thing. <laughs> eh, you'll figure it out. <gasps> A wharf roach! There's actually one. Die! Aha, I caught it! 
Now I can actually get that stupid thing off my list. I love the fact that you can just, uh... Keep at this all day. Catch fish, I can do that. Come here, fish! Oh, this one feels big. Well, that explains it. I love the fact that this thing is like half my my villager size. You gotta go. They're teaching them. I see. Best of luck. Okay. What other things can I squeeze in? You see, company? I wouldn't mind it afterwards. I think I'm. I'm thinking of raiding out. Do you have any raid suggestions in the meantime? Stupid mole crickets. I'm gonna go insane from these stupid things. I hate them. I have to dig up the entire earth just to find it. Anna's alive? Okay. No, it's not there. Where are you? Ah! Stop it, Walk Cricket! I'm angrily digging up the earth. <coughs> that tickled my throat. Where is it? I will not raid until I find a stupid mole cricket. I think it's right here. I did not want to dig there. Finally! Stupid mole cricket. Drive me insane. I still hate cicadas more though. Those things are awful. I remember that one time during band camp that there were shells and shells upon them upon the tree. Actually, n no joke there. <laughs> I wish I was joking, but no, they were everywhere. Made nice evening noises, but ugh. They were so icky. Eleven thousand seventy bells. Not bad. Okay, you know, I'm gonna go ahead and deposit this monies. And then I think we should raid out. It's getting dark. <laughs> My tracking's starting to lose traction. Pretty productive day on Animal Crossing. This is something I can play for like several hours at a time. Cause it's just very relaxing.
No, stop. Stop. Let's go ahead and deposit. I have, oh no, 25k. And donate 327 to Lloyd, or maybe a couple thousand actually. How many nook miles do I have? 18,100. I could get something if I wanted to. I try not to let my uh, nook miles funds get too low because I, I uh, sometimes I do need to take the tickets. So I can just go ahead and get more supplies like stone, iron, nuggets. You can, I'm sure you catch my drift. Has some fencing in a flash. Or decorating license. <laughs> yeah, sure, why not? I've got the I've got the miles for it. Why not? <laughs> Totally makes sense, yep. I know I can use accent walls and ceiling items to realize my vision. Why do I need a license for that? That's my own home. I can decorate however I want. <laughs> Why do I need a license for it? Do they think me that incompetent? SMH. DIY recipes. I can get a lot of these different things. Oh, Nano would love this thing. <laughs> this robot hero. Like a transformer. Girlfriend. Almost six hours long stream, y'all. Yeah. Told you I'm feeling good today. Yay, my app got updated after I paid miles for it. <laughs> Don't you just love paying for updates? Yeah, more customization options, let's go. I think I'm gonna go ham with these miles. <laughs> no camera app. I don't have it already? Okay. I right, find it funny I decided to get this. Yeah, I'm probably never gonna use it. Oh well. I, I can I can have an excuse and say I'd rather do it for a completionist. <laughs> Redeem the miles again. Excellent. Yeah, it's almost six hours, Nev. I already said that, but. <laughs> Why do you paint costume tips? Learn new eye colors. I want to do custom fencing. Yay! This is what I get for doing things all the time. I just redeem more miles and more miles after receiving miles and miles and miles.
Why do I color this? Best desig destination signpost. Fine. I should get one of these at some point. That one looks very pretty. Looks even better than the new leaf one. I applaud them for that. I wonder if at some point... I'll be able to mess with the terrain a little bit more. Ooh, there's so many of these that are pretty good. Wind turbine? Why does it cost so much? Why does that cost so much? Oh no. I could get one of these. Maybe. Uh... I'll choose one thing and then I'll save up so I can continue to get the, the, rest, the rest of them. While still having enough Nook Miles to get like a Nook ticket in case of emergencies. Just to get supplies. Like I said, for like stone. Maybe wood. Iron nuggets. You get the gist. Alright, I think that's enough for today. Ah! Collect in six hours today. Who knew I could do that with so much energy? I mean, I'm not like bouncing off the walls or anything, but like having enough to be able to do this stuff is kind of nice. Okay. Save complete. See you later. I'll see you guys later too. <laughs> I don't know when, but uh, I'd say if I'm keeping up this good health streak, taking care of myself and whatnot, I might stream more this week or next week. <sighs> we shall see. And when's are we gonna hang out in VC? I don't mind. Uh, just let me read out first. <laughs> Wait a second. Why does it say February 8th, 2024, 10, 16 a.m.? Wait a second. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna write out. <laughs> I'll fix the thing behind the scenes.